was up. I am chaos. The end of ends. Still race trapped in a cage of ice. Your best friend. But I'll take us. From Hala Ian. What is chaos? Wari no hate za endo. Kori no ori ni fuin sarish. Kurogare no bara. Nanti no tomo. Horo yen no hakos bells. Witness me. Witness me. Witness me. Welcome to the stream. It's all right. I'm just testing. I'm testing the game. You sound pumped. I am out. I have like. I have like a, a very dull stomach ache right now. And um, I'm going to blame that if I if I don't like the game. I mean, if I don't want to play the game anymore. <laughs> I have a very, very dull. Dull. It's like a dull. My tummy hurt. Yeah. You sound half dead. Wow, what a perfect way to play this game. That's about the undead. But... <laughs> I have mild discomfort. You ready for a short stream? It won't be that long, because I, I don't think my, 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 my blood pressure can handle this game. <laughs> but, um, you know what? It's, it's, it's going to be an experience. Are you allowed to play the uncensored version? I don't know. Can someone tell me if I if I what, what I what I can do and what I can't do? I had to look up Korsuki Biju's playthrough yesterday to realize to find out that we could play the English version. <laughs> it has to be the Japanese version. How do I know which one is the Japanese version? She's playing... Oh. Did I buy the wrong game? <laughs> oh. Hmm? <laughs> I have the... I don't... How do I know if this is the Japanese version? Oh my goodness. This is not planned. Wow. Oh my goodness. Does this mean that I can't play the game today? Did I buy the right game? Huh? I'm so confused. Oh no. Oh, oh no. I bought the wrong game. Ah! Hold on. Currently purchasing game. Everybody give me a moment. Uh, <laughs> Someone just told me to buy the one that was 2019! I don't know. Oh my goodness. Oh, well, we're off to a great start. I bought... I have Resident Evil 2. Not... Uh-oh. 
Well, that's just great, isn't it? All right, purchase. Biohazard RE2 Standard Edition. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Oh, oh, goodness. Did I buy the wrong one again? Wait, no, this was also 2019. In store. Hey. Hey. Uh uh. uh. Wait, what? I'm so confused! Wait, I can't... I can't download... What? <laughs> Where did the game go? I swear I pressed... Download. I can't find it. What the? Do I have to get rid of the normal Resident Evil 2 before I download the new Resident Evil 2? <laughs> no, you shouldn't need to. Why won't it let me buy? Hello? Okay, Resident Evil 2. Biohazard. That's just not because you already own one of the games you're trying to buy. What? Ah? Steam, can you... <laughs> I can't own both. Oh. Region lock! Wait. I'm so confused. It says I already have the game. But then it also tells me to add to cart. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna return the game real quick. I don't know what has happened. This is very, very strange. <laughs> um, 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 anyway, how you guys doing? Welcome to... Uh, I'm confused. Bay, Bay is very confused. How do I return a game? Um, what a way to start off the... You know, right? What a way to start the stream. Professional Bay. It didn't say anywhere that I couldn't play a certain version, so that's why I'm very confused. Is the real horror stream? Huh? 10 out of 10 stolen? Bruh. Uninstall. Okay. I'll get back to the store, and then we go. Resident Evil 2 Biohazard You already own this game What? <laughs> so I do have the right one Bro, you just I just uninstalled a game that I already have what I'm so confused. All right now we just okay Oh no What a twist. Oh no. It's 21 gigabytes. Downloading on Aussie internet. We're gonna be here for a while. Hi guys! Hi guys! Eat, eat, eat. 
I can... We can talk. Sure, we can talk. We can blame the... We can blame the... Who's, who's told me to uninstall it? We can blame... We can blame them. It's not my fault. Ah. <laughs> oh. Oh, is my connection dying? Yeah. Hold on. You can see the download. How about we do this instead? All right. Let's let's do this instead, okay? So that you don't, um, we, we don't. Yeah, we, we'll just do that. Yes, this is great. Um. <laughs> Look, we have many things to talk about though. While we wait for this goddamn game. Should I? Should I just not stream? I'm... Mm. I have finally downloaded one gigabyte out of 21 gigabytes. <laughs> A static stream. Oh no. Don't you dare run from this. I know, but I'm... I just... This is not... Okay. Well... It do be downloading. It's not that bad. Okay. Well, we can talk. Um. Is that bad, huh? <laughs> oh my god, I'm on a thousand. Oh my goodness. You know what? You can deal with 140, 144. You can deal with 144 ping bay. Because I want to talk to you. I want to see you when I talk to you. Okay. I see five pixels. Good. Good, good, good. You're looking cool in your 144p model. Thank you. Thank you very much. How fast is your download speed? I don't even want to expose it. It's kind of sad. Now, anyway. Um, we do have things to talk about, though, before... While we wait for this game to download. One thing is... Did you see what was announced? Oh gosh, it's gone red. You know what? I'm gonna be back in twelve minutes. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'll be hold on. I'll be right back. I don't even know what's happening anymore. I'd... Oh, that's all right. Well, verifying isn't downloading, so it's just literally it's another six. Anyway, welcome to the stream. What's up? I need a tweet again. Hold on. It's all right. We do five minutes of dust when we start the stream. Anyway, it doesn't matter. The pixel's great. Hi. Um. Oh, what's up? I am chaos! At uh, the end of ends! A silver is trapped in a cage of ice. Your best friend, Bell's hate cost. Witness me! Does 
Good morning, everyone. How's everyone doing? Is everyone doing good? You guys having a good day? Just having a great day. <laughs> How'd you sleep? I slept really well. Yeah, I know. I'm. A <laughs> I'm surprised you that you're playing this game. Me too. I actually don't know if I can finish this game just because I have heard that it is scary, and I don't know why I decided to choose this game. But you know, maybe I've gotten braver over time. It also concerns me that the entire game looks very dark. You know? So... It's not that scary. Ugh. See? There's people saying that it's scary and harder than Village. Ugh. Thank you so much for the gifted! Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Village is scarier. Really? Oh. Uh oh. Anyway, um. While we wait, I mean, not wait, I mean, you know, just to fill in our morning zatsu for today, I would like to say how many things have been <laughs> announced. Yes, very many exciting things have been announced. Um, what's one thing that has been announced? Oh my god, Fifth Fest! Wow, Hollow Fest! I didn't see that coming. My goodness. You guys excited for Fifth Fest? Wow, who would have thought? Fifth Fest hype! Fourth Fest just felt like yesterday. I mean, I feel like Fourth Fest felt like a while ago, but it's still a fresh memory, if that makes sense. <laughs> I can't believe that fifth comes after fourth. Right? <laughs> going to Japan for the first time in years for fifth fest. Can't wait to be there. Are you gonna go? Ooh. Ooh. Man. The year, this year has gone by so quickly. It's kind of ridiculous. Ah, oh, it's kind of ridiculous. Next thing you know, it'll be for Bayri already, bruh. Bruh. It's the end of October. When did that happen? I swear it was just January, like yesterday. Are you done verifying yet? Yeah, this is a very long five minutes. 43, 42, 41, 40, 39, 38, 37, 35, what? 34, 33, 32, 31, 30 seconds, 29. 28, 27, 26, 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. I'm now opening the game. Happy New Year. <laughs> okay. 
Wait, so if it has Japanese language, does that mean it's the Japanese version? Is that how that works? The English version also has Japanese audio. Ah, okay. All done. All done, all done. Oh, you hear that? You hear that, everybody? Uh. Oh, is chat working? Okay, hold on. Why is it so loud? Excuse me. Options. Okay. Um, graphics. No. Controls. What? Camera. Um. I mean, it has Japanese on it, but... Oh no, is this the uncensored version? Oh no. Oh no. Where can I turn the sensor on? Mm. Default. No. Uh... Lens. Huh. You know what? <sighs> Display. Continue? What? What do you mean continue? I have never played this game before! What do you mean continue? Huh. It's probably just there by default. Okay. Huh. <gasps> There are two scenarios. Ooh. Which one do we do? We play Leon. You said you peeked at it. I mean, I didn't. I opened the game. That's all I did. Leon is default. No. Oh, it's two slightly different stories. I did hear that um, this one provides some context for Resident Evil 4, I think. So...
aim assist recover a certain amount of health Industrial city in the heart of America. The one Leon S. Kennedy was assigned to protect and serve as he drives up. Oh. <laughs> I don't remember the controls. I don't know the controls. Is that a bird? I mean, a, a burger? Sorry, I don't know why I said a bird. Okay. Okay. You drunk? Okay. Oh no. Look, just listen, all right? American so Angus B. Mm. The face was rotting! Ew. Ew! Sounds like my wife. Hey! That's a little bit rude. Excuse me. Oh, you're gonna die. You're gonna pay for that wife comment. Just getting good. Bruh. You're gonna die. I need some sleep. Woo! Bam! Ew, 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 it's a zombie, it's a zombie, it's a zombie, ew, 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 What are you gonna do? You gonna walk away? Buddy? Buddy? What do you do? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Woo! Wow. Who are you? Wow! Oh, hello. Hello. No one's around. Oh, hello. I, I like your hairstyle. He's a handsome boy. Weird. Turn the volume up slightly. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Neon Kyun. Oh. Explore my surroundings. I don't have a weapon. Oh, okay, hold on. Let's. Uh, I did crank up the brightness because it's a little bit lower on my end. Uh, and also because I'm a little bit scared. Okay, you don't need to. You don't need to antagonize me for it. Okay, I'm a little bit scared. Okay, I'm a coward. Yes. Um, where is mouse sensitivity? Camera. Okay. Much better. <laughs> Someone give me a weapon, please. Run home! Leon, run home! That's all you need to do. You just need to run home, okay? Take your car and leave.
Hello? Anybody there? Bro, this guy's got got courage. Hmm. Oh no. Oh no, not the flashlight. Anything but Something's the flashlight. Not right. Investigate the store. No, I don't want to. Ooh, I hear someone here. Are you okay? You all right? Oh no, you've been bit. Stay away from me. Don't move. I'll be back for you. He ain't okay. He ain't okay. Nobody okay. Stop moving. Officer, you need help? Stay back, sir. I got this. Oh, that's disgusting! Oh, he's zombie. Hello. Freeze! I'll shoot! Draw. Oh, oh shit. First to aim docker, leave me alone. Can I get more ammo, please? No loot. That's great. <laughs> Why am I already scared? All right. Hey, what are you doing? We got locked in. Um. Uh oh. Oh, I need a key. Can you stop with this music? This music not cool, fam. Also, what are these controls? I feel like I'm not actually moving. All right. Hello. Oh, there's a key. Nice. Escape from the store. Okay. Oh. Is he coming back alive? That is bullshit. This can't be. Thank you. Oh, I don't like that. Uh. Run! Ah! What the? Dude, that's not fair. Uh. Oh! Leon, come on, run. The door is right there. So, thanks. Thank you look cute together. When we're safe. Oh. Did you guys tell me that he's 18 in this? Some answers at the police station. Uh-uh. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah. 
Leon Kennedy. Oh, you are. Nice to meet you. Claire. Claire Redfield. Is that why you have a red jacket? I like how you dress to your name. Here? No. Looking for my brother. He's a cop too. Oh, he did. Probably. Well, <laughs> it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. Hold up. Car mirror. Wow. Whoa. Oh, my goodness. Boot. Wow! Wow! I don't like the fact that they don't die because at least in Resident Evil Village, at least they die. <laughs> How are you here after an hour? Look, I had a situation, okay? <laughs> I had a situation. Yes. Due to the citywide outbreak, you were advised Take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Raccoon? Base. It's not Raccoon, but Raccoon? It's called Raccoon! Oh, this is so unreal. Oh my god. The police station's not much farther. They'll know something. Oh my god. Yeah, but... What if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. You reproduce. What? It's a big city. There has to be. Okay. Looks like we're walking from here. Uh oh. Did did they just oh oh more like running. Yeah, good call. Oh no, oh it's oh, you. There, get out. Get out now! I can't. Oh they oh they're about to get isekai. They're about to get isekai. Oh Leon! Oh! Oh 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 Leon! Oh I I saw that hit on the steering wheel! Oh does she still have the resolution on 16? Yes, I do. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? I can increase the vision. I can increase the... <laughs> Big boom. Oh, no. Is it blurry? Yeah, it's probably I have the graphics on medium as well. Claire! Claire, are you okay? No, Claire did. Claire did. Yeah. Oh. All right. How about you? How is that possible? How are they both still alive? You can't stay here. It's not safe. Go on ahead. I'll meet you at the station. Pause. Oh. I'll be there. Okay. Get to the. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, excuse me. This is out of control. Okay. Get to the police station. How do I get how do I get to the police station? I feel like I'm going the wrong way. Am I going the wrong way? I, I think I'm going the wrong way. There's a little alley here. Wait. I'm gonna pause for a second. Hold on. Okay, 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 okay. I can increase the... Let's increase... 
Uh, I think that's it. Is that it? Oh, this one. Okay. Go towards the light. Oh, that's a dead end. That's nice. Hold on! Go towards the light. I'm going towards... Can I jump? No, no. Get off me. Run. I'm a little bit lost. Go towards the light. Okay. Shit. Ooh. They've all turned. Yes, they've all turned into zombies. Everybody is zombie. Oh, I found it! There it is. The station. Rah, rah, rah! I think it's your screen resolution. Yeah, I know, but I don't want it to be full screen. Ah! <laughs> Also, I think motion thing is on. I want to turn that off. Uh, I'm going to get sick. Hold on. Where is motion blur? Uh-huh. On. I mean, off. Lens distortion. Turn your brightness down. Hold on. Is it because I have... It might be because I have this on okay chromatic off bloom off okay. what's chromatic c Cro chromatic mm. Turn off your room lights too, should be increased and pull. I'm gonna turn them on right now. Yes. Off. There we go. Depth of field. On. Camera. Camera wobble. Off. Okay, field of view. Increase. Okay. How does that look? Oh, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Please move. Looks better. Okay. It's the raccoon police! Welcome to the city of the dead. Okay. I think the field of view was a little bit too big. Do that. There we go. Full screen is scary. Hello. There we go. Hello. Is anybody here? Safe. <laughs> yes. I got handgun ammo. Very nice. Nice bite mark. Leave me alone. <laughs> what is this? Oh, 
Oh, that's eerie. Oh, he dead. Hey, he dead. Not good. David, Marvin, you there? I found a way out. It's in here. Dude, that, dude, that was point blank range. <laughs> that was point. That was, that was point blank range. <laughs> that it's like you have a gun, and then it's like instead of shooting, you push him away. Bro. Okay. The map screen is useful for more than your. Okay. Um. So I have to go to the east office. Okay. Just like you, Bay, I resent that. Can I reload? Thank you very much. What's this? Cool. Ooh! Oh, looks like I have to find three medals or something. You gotta save ammo. Well, I will say, they move a lot slower, the zombies, than, than village. I remember, a good thing about village is that they did. I heard something. Good thing about village was that they they stayed dead. But a good thing about this one is, you know, they they move slow though. It's a puzzle. I don't like these sounds. No who done this? Okay, so I need to find something with symbols on it. I see. It is but the wind. Where am I? I'm in the main hall. I don't know. I'm going here? And it's locked. Why is my camera sensitivity still so high? Excuse me. Thank you. It's not automatic pickup. I have to select it every single time. That doesn't seem nice. Okay. Oh, Ammo for days! Everything is locked! Why is everything locked? Is there something at the tape? Oh! Oh, it's a chest! Okay. That's where I guess I can put my loot. Now that I'm there. Where am I supposed to go? <laughs> I'm supposed to go to the watchman's room. How do I get there? Okay, so I have to go through the east office. Oh, I'm going to get lost. This is great. This is absolutely great. It's amazing. Oh, what's this? Nice. Keep out. Oh. That's it. Ew. 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 Okay, so I have to go up. And then turn right. And then turn right. Ew. What's this? Oh, and they find a fuse. That's nice. Yeah, you got this. You got... <laughs> you serious, Leon? Oh, I was supposed to hold it, sorry. I was like, Leon, I swear. I thought you were more built than this. Okay. Turn right. Turn right. Jesus. Ooh, what's these? Oh. Open up! Hurry! 
Okay, okay. Calm. Okay, I'm coming. Calm down. I'll get you out. So impatient. Please, give me your hand. I got you. Oh, can I get the book instead? Give me your other hand. Oh, he did. Oh no! Oh, he did. Oh, he's so dead. Why am I still holding? Oh. Oh, that's disgusting. Oh no. Oh no 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 no. Is this the uncensored version? If the VOD dies, I guess the VOD dies. Huh. Mm. Hmm. Okay. Got a statue. Oh, you have to go down and there's parking in the way. Oh, okay, okay. So I do need to find the three medallions. <gasps> oh, okay, okay, okay. The first... Dude, what kind of drawing is that? I can't even make... I cannot make out what that says. Okay. I'm out. Oh. Run. Whew. Hello, everybody. Oh, I went the wrong way. Oh, hello, everybody. Jesus. They're Boom. everywhere. Boom. Jesus. Boom. Oh, they're everywhere. Oh, is that the way? This way. Go in there! Come on. Get to the set. Come on, Leon! Come on, Leon! Very nice! Ah! Kick him in the face! Kick him in the face! Watch out! Oh, beheaded! Beheaded! Oh! Who are you? Thanks. Marvin Brenner. Marvin? Leon Kennedy. There was another officer I, I couldn't... Marvin? Here. Have you been bitten, sir? <clears throat> sir? I'm sure you did what you could, Leon. Sir? Have you been bit? Does anyone know what started this? Not a clue. But honestly, all you need to know is that this place will eat you alive if you aren't careful. Yeah, well, I was supposed to start last week, and I got a call to stay away. I wish I'd come here sooner. Well, Leon being the yeah, hero. Yeah, Leon, that's all that matters. Okay, Lieutenant, I'm ready. Well, at least he's got gear well, now. I feel safer already. That officer you met earlier, Elliot. Uh huh. He thought this secret passageway might do the trick. Mm. This is good news. We can get you to a hospital. No, no, I am not the priority here. Lieutenant, I'm not just gonna leave you here. I'm giving you an order, rookie. You save yourself first. Marvin. 
I'd come with you, but I'd just slow you down. <gasps> Arvin! Now, you'll need this. I can't take it. Stop. Is that a knife? And don't make my mistake. What was your mistake? If you see one of those things, uniform or not, you do not hesitate. Sir, yes, sir! Take it out. Or you run. Got it? Sir, yes, sir! Yes, sir. <laughs> oh. Knife! Um. Ready sub weapon. How do I use it again? Eh? Oh, I have to press space. Okay. Yeah, right. I should save. Where is the? Oh, over there. Oh, wait, nope. It's over here. I got a knife. I got myself a knife. Hey. Cool. <sighs> okay, we have to go... Wait, we go upstairs. There was the first medallion... Over... There somewhere. Okay. 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 This is lion. Okay. Excuse me. I don't look at my inventory. There we go. Um... Mom, if you take damage, your health monitor will drop from fine. Okay. Heal yourself with a green herb or a first aid spray before it's too late. Okay. 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 Who's lion again? I can't read that. Lion head, herb, and bob. Lion head. Lion head. Fern and burb. Oh. Oh. Nice. Now we put here. Right. Yeah, but the passage isn't open yet. Now what? But the other rooms are. Do you have a key, sir? Sir? Do you have a key that I can use by any chance? Um. Uh. Maybe I can search the other... Mm. Here, maybe? <gasps> Genius! Genius! This is not how I imagined my first day. <gasps> Ammo I see. Here we are. <gasps> Herb! Thank you! Oh no. Oh no! Oh no! You can discard the key. Oh, I can. Okay. 
Let's put the key. Put the key away. Actually, no. He's already complaining about his job on the first day. I mean, if you were called into job and this is what you had to do on the first day, I would complain too. Are you alive, sir? Nobody move. Where am I? There's a door there. Which I'm guessing I have to go through. Are you alive? Oh no. I don't think he's dead. Leon? Le Leon? Leon? Le Leon? Ew! Fuck. Ew! Huh? Disgusting! Oh, n oh my goodness. Is there something on the ground? Oh, there's a door. God damn it. Eesh. 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 Nobody know I'm here. Nobody knows I'm here. Lore? Record of events. Aha. Uh -huh. September 25th. We're turning into the station into a temporary shelter due to the massive sudden outbreak. All police personnel have been instructed to make the safety of the citizens their top priority as we try to accommodate as many of them as possible. One of the refugees attacked us in the middle of the night, resulting in the death of one officer injuring three. The person in question was quickly restrained. We believe this was the simple case of someone snapping under intense stress. I don't believe that was the case. 26th. A mob attacked the station, resulting in a number of casualties. Few survivors were able to make it safely behind the emergency shutters, but surrounded as we are, it'd be hard for any of us to escape this place. We're not sure we can fix any of our common our comm equipment, so we remain cut off from the outside world. There was another clash on the west, west side at the station, 1pm. 12 people died, only a handful of survivors. Everything is falling into disarray. Damn. So what are you telling me? Is that we're all left? Don't you dare. Is there anything here that I need? Yes, yes, there is. No! I was trying to get to the door! Okay. Oh, that didn't. Oh. Are you dying, Leon? Shay. I see. I'm so confused. Where am I supposed to go? Hold on. Oh, there was another. Oh. Oh. Oh, 
Oh my god. You need- What? Give me my knife back. Give me my knife back. Give me my knife back. Never using my knife again. I thought I could slash! What? Ooh. Ooh. My god. I'm never using this knife again. How do I... Can I use knife? Nope. Nope. Man! Oh, there's a way out here. Oh, and she's back alive. Okay. Excuse me, I'm going to leave. Oh. Hold on. Um... Where do I go? I can go into the safety deposit room, which is on the left. Uh. Don't mind me. Hello. Oh. Uses of gunpowder. Oh. Gunpowder and gunpowder. And gunpowder? And gunpowder. There's not a lot of ammo left in the station, so make use of any gunpowder that you might find. Gunpowder and gunpowder create ammo. Okay. Mag ammo. High grade gunpowder. Oh. Hi. Gunpowder! This is scary. Oh, are you dead or alive? <laughs> oh, you're alive. Oh. What's this? <gasps> Rookie's first assignment! <laughs> we are putting you on a very special case on your first assignment. <laughs> nice first mission. Your mission is to unlock your desk. The key to your success is in the initials of our first names. Who's our? Input the letters in order of our desk. There are two locks, one on each side of your desk. Make sure you get them both. Basically, your first task is to remember your fellow officers' names. You figured that much out, right? Much what? Wait, here. Good luck, Leon. It might take a little work to get Scott to give you a straight answer. Be glad you're not here, rookie. Oh... Who's Lieutenant? Oh, is that Marvin? I remember his last name. Oh, you're alive. Oh, are you alive? Oh, okay. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm trying to unlock my desk. Just... Okay. Uh. What's my name? Lut. I don't know what my name is. Lieutenant! What was my middle name? <laughs> What was my middle name? Uh, Lieutenant! Uh... What was... <laughs> oh, there's no K on here. Oh, I guess it's... Lieutenant... M... What? Oh, it's my co-worker's name. I need to know his name. Bro, David... Oh, gosh. I'm trying to... <gasps> no! Oh, no, my knife! Oh, god damn it. You, 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 you. Disgusting. I'll get my life knife later. What's your name? What's your name? Marvin? I can't read that. R Rita... P R P. Rita Phillips. Uh... David Ford. Yeah. What? David... 
David D F P R. Read the note. I'm I'm so lost. Yo, this is why I don't like. Oh, initials of our first names. Oh, Leon. Wait, Leon. <laughs> Leon. Marvin. David. Rita. Oh my god. Okay. M. R. I don't know what your name is. Oh, S. You're Scott. Okay. What's your name? <gasps> N. E. Is this. Wait. N. E. D. Ned! Ned! Okay, 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 okay. Your name is Ned. Okay. N. E. D. Yeah, baby. Okay. And then over here is... M... R... S? Is your name Scott? M S R? Excuse me? No, this is M R... Eh? What's your name? Um, what's your name? Do you have a name? Is it on your person? Do I need to read your... Do you have a name tag? I can't read that. What does that say? George? Oh. Sorry, George. Sorry, George. Matilda. Nice. All right. Um, which which one of you had my knife? Which one of you had my knife? Uh, was it you? Which one of you had my knife? My knife is gone. Big boy in the corner. Oh, you had my knife. Thank you. For oh my god, my knife is nil. Okay. Next, where do we go? Where do we go? Ooh, ooh, ooh. I need to find um medallion, right? Anything here? You dead? Man, I do hope. Oh. Uh. Did I wake you up? I think I woke him up. God damn it! Uh. Hello? Hello? Okay. Don't come here. Come over here! Over here! That's a good boy! That's a good boy! Good boy! Now stay there. Alright. Is there anything here? There's, there's nothing... Hmm? No! Boy, I said to stay... Nice. 
Anything here? Nope. Good boy! Aww, you're crawling on the floor. Aww, what's wrong? Shit! <laughs> okay, Leon, it's okay. Oh god, the shadow just kind of freaked me out. Okay, it has to be on a table somewhere, right? Maybe there? Alright. You're in my way! Come on. Come on! Okay. Maybe... Oh! <gasps> okay! It's down to me and three others. No weapons, no ammo. Too many skirmishes have drained us mentally and physically. We're not gonna make it. Officer Phillips suggests we escape through the sewers. Interesting. Elliot! Oh, this was the person that gave us the notebook. I brushed her idea up, and now it's not sa sounding all that... ...bad. I don't want to sit here and wait to die either. It's a long shot. I'm gonna find out what I can do about that tunnel. And tell me shit. I need... I need a lock code. Uh. Oh, I can go through that door, I think. Whoa! <sighs> no. Dark room? Wait, did I just miss the safety deposit room? I think I did. Ah! <laughs> Give me back my knife. Hello? I don't want to deal with you. Rip knife. Oh, we're broken! It's alright. Storage! Here we go. It appears the keypad to the lockers is missing a few keys. I suggest the person responsible for this mess find some spare keys and fix it right now. You know who you are. Who else would F it up this badly? <laughs> okay, we're gonna find some spare keys. What? Oh my. <gasps> oh. Extra storage. What's in there? I want ammo. Oh, hello. Wait. Oh, I can open it. Oh, I see. And this one needs a card. Okay. Um, 208. Cool, 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 cool. Loopik, loopik, loopik. Okay. What's the other one? I forgot the number. What is it? 203... 208... Is there one that I can't... Oh. Was it 109? Oh. <laughs> it can't be that easy, but why can't it be that easy? Oops. One oh two, one oh three, one oh six. You okay? Is there a one oh six? Oh, there is. <gasps> I 
I got film? What is that? Boy, what are you doing over there? Okay. I guess I got film. Oh, now I have to go to the dark room. Ooh, uh, I'll be back. I'll be back. Okay. Okay, nobody move. Um, safety. Okay, so I have to go backwards. And then turn left, and then turn right. <sighs> How does Zuma Bay know what camera film is? Not that stupid. Hello. Bye bye. Ooh. Yes, please. Ooh. No! Rejected. <gasps> All righty. Give me lore. Give me lore. Give me lore. Give me lore. The medical benefits of hobes. Green herbs have the ability to heal basic injuries. Blue herbs have long been used to treat poisoning. Red herbs are visually appealing, but they offer no medicinal benefits. It's well known that combining herbs together produces blends that heighten the herbs' effects. It has been... There's something to my right. It's been discovered that red herbs can play a big role when mixed properly. According to one doctor, mixing blue and red... Red herbs together produces a blend that will strengthen one's constitution. Wow! What's to my right? Is a zombie gonna come out at me? I'm ready. I'm ready for you. I'm ready for you. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Oh. Gunpowder! Turn the light on. Oh. Film contains evidence. Do not leave out. Nice herb. That is extremely scary. Excuse me? Commemorative photo. Okay. What does that do? Combining items. Oh. <gasps> what happens if I combine? Fully restore health. Wow. Um. Do we just get a nice picture? Okay. 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 Um. Oh my. This place is huge. You are so sus. Well, well, well. Oh, I can go upstairs. Well, well, well. Oh. Hello. Oh. Oh, row, row, row. Oh, row, row, row. 
Sorry, I missed. Son of a bitch. Said that right. Thank you. Ah. Oh. <laughs> okay, so I gotta find a crank. Okay. Um, ooh. Uh, uh, it's a dead end. Where did you come from? Oh, that's creepy. Why does it look like there's a person there? Okay. Do you see that? <laughs> Go for it. Just run for it. Run away, run away, run away, run away, run away. I don't know what that was! Run away! Woo! I may be a bit dead. I may be a bit dead. That's okay. Oh, I don't know what that was. Oh, no, no, no. Oh. Okay, the locker one wasn't that scary because I'm I was still processing the the, the scare for what whatever the f that thing was outside the house the creepy crawly that was the the locker the locker zombie is not that that scary all I gotta do now is anticipate that every single locker has a zombie in it that's fine. It's fine, everything is fine. Okay. Yeah. 
Oh, it's a safe. Oh. Oh, portable safe. Okay, press a press a button to to light up its corresponding lamp. Light all of them to open this safe. The buttons must be pressed in a certain order. Pressing a single or button out of oh. that one okay <laughs> yeah, da! 140 IQ yeah baby the wrong key whoops all right let's go back down we have to go back to the security deposit oh you broke through then what's the point of me putting up the oh it's all right let me check the map where am i went right past it it's right here ah! <laughs> Have a timeout. I was trying. <laughs> oh, I'm screwed. I missed. You bastard. Timeout. 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 Am I gonna die? It's fine. Um, I want to put it there. Wait. What are the benefits? Let's see. Two gets me... <gasps> I get a knife on two though. No. Two it is, two it is, two it is. We need two. We need two first. Okay. Okay, 102. Gunpowder. Very nice. Does perhaps one of them have a heal? Oh, extra baggage space. Oh, I do like that. Okay, rah, rah, rah. And 208. Rah, rah, rah. Can you calm down? Rah, rah, rah. It's all you ever do. Rah, rah. Wait, what was it? 20208 20, 203 Sorry, I cut you off mid rar. I don't even have shotgun yet. I'm over here. I'm over here. All right. Go this way. You don't have a three. I know. I need to go find another three. Oh, wait. Why did I do that? Okay. Let's go. Where do we go now? Where do we want to go now? Um. Hmm. Should we go back to the main hall? Maybe. Oh, yeah, I have a spade key.
key. That's right. That's right. That's right. I can go through the the other door now. Okay. Nobody move. Let me figure out my way back. What was that sound? Okay. Um. So I have to go behind. Turn left. Turn left. Did he speak? We turn left. Whoa! <laughs> Excuse me. What? Uh, turn up. Go up, go through the door, and then go through that door and go all the way around. Okay. That's just cool. Oh, I am a hundred percent dying. Who? Who? Bro. Okay. Dude, I'm lost. That's not the right way. Oh wait, spade key! Spade key! Yeah, I know, I know Leon, I know Leon. Okay, calm down. Cutscene. Oh, cutscene! There you are. Come here. Take a look. Yes. I knew she'd make it. Oh, she's alive. You know her? Yeah. Name's Claire. I came into town with her. You can get to that courtyard. Through the second floor. East side. I'm on it. Marvin, you don't look so good. Thanks, Lieutenant. Marvin, you're not looking so good. But do you, do you happen to have a heal by any chance? Uh, just by any chance, do you, do you happen to have a, a heal that I could? You're not looking too good either. <laughs> okay, well, at least we saved. It's fine. If we die, we can just respawn back here. All right. Gives Marvin some herbs to munch on. No. N. Oh, where am I supposed to go? Sorry. What did Marvin say? Marvin, what did you say? Marvin, I wasn't. I was really. I was just paying attention to how that I'm kind of dying, and I didn't listen to what you said. Where is Claire? Can you tell me again, Marvin? <laughs> East side, second floor. East, which way is east? Oh, this east side, second floor. Ah. Uh, how do I go up the stairs? Like fire escape. Ding. Well, let's go up the stairs first. Okay. Wow, well, Leon. You're not doing so good, are you? Oof. I know, walking up the stairs. A little bit tough. Seems like a little tough. <gasps> Is that an herb? Oh, just a plant. Just a plant! Oh, 
Oh, here. Let's see. Ah! <sighs> Saved. Pamphlet. Welcome to Raccoon City. Did you know that while we're in the home of a pharmaceutical giant umbrella corporation, Raccoon City is a vibrant and dynamic city with a long rich history of its own. In this guide we'll introduce you to just a few of the more unusual points of interest. Building in the center of the town wasn't always a police station, it used to be an art museum. Oh my god, wait, I had a red! Oh. Giant Umbrella Corporation, Raccoon City is a vibrant and dynamic city with a long, rich history of its own. In this guide, we'll introduce you to just a few more unusual points of interest our city has to offer. The building in the center of the town wasn't always a police station. Oh my god, did you guys know that? In fact, it used to be an art museum. Various features like the unusual clock tower and the goddess statue into the, in the main hall reminders of the bygone era. Ah. Oh no, there's an orphanage. Oh no. It's run by the Umbrella Corporation. Oh no, why do I feel like that was being used for, to test whatever happened here? Oh, I have a bad... I have a bad feeling about this orphanage. Whenever you put an orphanage in a horror game... Oh goodness. Oh no, 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 no. Um, the building is known for its stained glass window. Oh no. Oh no. Ooh. Why are there so many safes? Yet nothing to open the safe with. Exaquiza me. Oops. I'm scared. I'm scared.
Oh, there's something behind. Ooh. There's an art room. We need to find... Eh? Okay. What was that sound? Leon, was that you? God, you're terrifying. Wait a second! The ruby that captivated Edward the Black Prince, the pearl that the Queen of the Nile milk dried, the diamond that led a queen to the guillotine. There is no end to the number of tales, to the appeal of jewels. This mysterious red stone is simply the latest to sparkle among them. Like those other jewels, this one's origin is unknown. It's said that it adorned a noblewoman's jeweled box and was even dedicated to a wise king. This fall, this stone has long been shrouded in legend, will be on display during auction. This jewel has turned caring nobles who love their subjects into despots. More terrible than Caligula. Cal Caligula. Oh no. Okay, I need to find a book for you. You okay? But first! Wait! Can I go back to the... Can I go back to the... Can I go back to the... Can I go back to the weapons room? Thank you. All right. I want to go back to the weapons room. You said that's so wrong. It hurts. I'm sorry. Hi, Marvin. Are you still alive? Good. All right. We'll save. Please. Okay. Uh, was there a shortcut? Yes. Where am I? Okay. I can go through the west. Sometimes, Leon, you run very funny. Okay. We can go through the west office. Go in, and then we go out, and then into the safety deposit room. Now, hold up. Eesh. Everybody did. Oh, they put a sign for me. Oh, so it's right. Okay. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, welcome, Leon. Nice. Okay. Two though. I want it to be. F I want it to be one. <sighs> okay. Must save. Must save it. All right. Now I need some more shotgun ammo. Marvin, you still alive? Good. Okay. I swear to God, is is <laughs> the way that Leon runs sometimes is not the way that I want him to run. Okay. Anyway. All right. I'm ready. I'm ready for whatever that thing was. Was it a helicopter? Got a shotgun. Don't test me. 
He's just a little bit goofy. No, I swear his like controller strafing or something. I don't know. The way he's running, he's a rookie leave him alone. <laughs> uh... All right. Whoa. Is everyone all right? Oh no. Oh, oh no. Hey! Claire! Leon? Claire! Hold on, I'll be right there. Okay! I'm very sus about you, Claire. How are you still alive? I was gonna get bomb! I was gonna get bomb bomb! Careful, the bomb bomb bomb! Claire. It's so nice to see Leon, you. Leon, there's not the time to flirt! Oh, Open the goddamn oh, door! Man. You've known this woman for like two hours, okay? No time to flirt! Liam! No. But how are you doing? No! Stop it, Liam! No. Time and place. Surviving. Claire, stop it's flirting great. back. Yeah. Any luck with your brother? No, not yet. <sighs> there, don't lose hope. I'm sure we're gonna find him. Yeah, sure. Oh wow! Boom, boom! You didn't think that would happen? Wow, Leon. You know what that means? Yeah. Time. Oh my god, Leon. This is all because you couldn't just save it for another time. You take care of yourself. God damn it, Leon. Leon! You need to go. Now. Could have just opened the door. Okay. Let's get through this. Both of us. Uh, Marvin, I've got a situation here. I'm surrounded by zombies. Wait, where did I need that again? There were a lot of doors that. Marvin, do you copy? Oh, Marvin did. Marvin. Oh, Marvin. So. Can... Damn it. Hello. Oh no, not the Marvin. Oh, Marvin. Oh no, Marvin. Where are we? Oh, we're back here. Eh? Sorry. Hold on. I'm a little bit confused. Uh... <laughs> Wait. Can I go into... Oh, hi. Oh, this way. Okay, you can't duck, bro. This way? This way. I missed the ammo! <gasps> Nowhere! Oh. Where did I miss ammo? <gasps> oh no, no, no. Excuse me. Oh no, no, no. Nice. Are we good now? Are we good now? Okay, we're good. Oh, wait, 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 wait. There's a. Oh, I thought I could block that one up. Oh! Hello. Goodbye. Ah, how did you get me? It's <laughs> uh, kind of funny. Where am I? Okay, can I go into the east office? Yes, I can, because I broke that. Oh. Goodbye, everyone. Ooh, what's this? <gasps> Found a fuse! Oh, no. Uh... I need a window. Is there a window somewhere? Aha! Son of a bitch. I know, right? Stay down. Okay. Oof. 
contained! Run! Run! But first fuse. Just healed. Is that still alive? In what universe is that still alive? That's not still alive, Leon. Okay. Can I put the key back now or do I need this key? Maybe I still need this key. Um. Oh, there's another gunpowder there. Oh, I'm going back there. Oh, there's so much ammo! Okay, we're going back into the east office. Um... I don't know what that is. Flash grenade, gunpowder, handgun ammo. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. Uh... Press room. Use the shotgun to dispose of the... But I want to save the shotgun, though. I would like to save the shotgun, though. I would like to save the shotgun, though. So, it's right there. Okay. You think I can sneeze? You're my first. Oh! What? Okay. Flash grenade! Uh, equipped on the inventory screen to use. Guaranteed to stun and daze enemies within its effective radius. Okay. How do I... Excuse me? What? How do I use it? Oh, inventory? Oh. Huh? I'm missing anything else. Oh, there's ammo in there. Got you. Oh no. How are you still alive? What the hell? I know, right? <gasps> Dude, how are you still alive? <laughs> Run away. Run away. Okay, I don't need that. I don't need the ammo. I don't need ammo. Nobody need ammo. It's fine. I have ammo. Okay. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is why you shouldn't be a loot demon, bay. Oh, that poor ammo. 
Where am I supposed to go now? There's a full heal in the bathroom. Ew. The press room. Oh. There's something else I'm missing in the office. Oh no. Okay, we're gonna aim for the bathroom first. I may die though. I may die though. I may, I may die though. Okay. We go left, go down, then turn right. Then we turn left into the bathroom. Okay. Okay. Oh, Leon not looking very, not looking pretty good. Oh, door. Okay, we'll go past that room. Into the bathroom. Where's, where's my full heal? Oh no, there's gonna be a zombie in here. Knock knock. Knock knock. <gasps> gonna be okay! Okay, now... We go to the press room, which is... Oh my god, Leon, sometimes the way you walk needs help. What's in here? Oh! Hello? Oh! Oh, you did! I just looted a dead body! Oh, they're having a party! Really? There's nothing? There's nothing? You know what? I think it's time to get back that ammo. The worst party ever! Which way should we go? We should go... Out, and then we turn... Wait, which way am I facing? I turn right! Right? I turn right, and then we'll go straight, and then turn left. God damn it, I swear to God. And turn left. The directions is what... Excuse me. Okay, so the ammo is on... Leon, 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 Leon. Dude! Dude! Oh my god, I am... Dude, I'm just pissed now. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I'm dead. I did. Oh, I very did. I'm not getting that goddamn ammo. We're gonna go into the bathroom. We're gonna go into the press room. And we're never going into that little room again. You need that room? God freaking damn it! 
I need the crank. I do need the crank. <laughs> okay, we'll have to clear the room. Okay, okay. Everything's fine. Okay. Everything fine. Okay. Everything fine. Alrighty. Where was it again? Over here. Okay. Okay, then. Okay. Use that one. Okay, and then we go out, turn to the left. Down here. Go into the press room. Turn the light on. Get some more ammo. Okay, we're doing great. All right, time Whew, to clear the room. Here we go. Which way is it? This way. Go back and save. Honestly. Kind of smart. <laughs> kind of smart. Okay. I'm ready. I'm ready. That was it. <laughs> I missed the room. Okay, you lit up the disgusting. Let's stick to the wall. I don't know how. That's great. Wonderful. Yes, get them off Leon. You're doing great. Okay, now we run. Eugene! I don't know why I decided to call you Eugene, but I'm calling you Eugene. Run, 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 Eugene! I am stuck. I am stuck. I'm, I'm very... I'm stuck. I, I literally am stuck. <laughs> Freaking damn it, Eugene. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's try that again. Eugene, get over here. Nice gunpowder. Where's my ammo? Oh, someone's alive. Eh? Oh, there it is. Who's alive? Oh, it's you. Whoa! You can't climb over the desk like that! Alrighty. <gasps> Safe. Okay. We good? Alrighty. Now we have to go back to the... Where was the place that had the steam again? It was the stupid locker... It was the stupid zombie and locker place. Where was that again? 
fun! What's upstairs? It was second, it was upstairs to the... Uh... It was upstairs. Also, I think Marvin's dying. Or maybe already dead. Just saying. Was it through here? I think it might have been through here. Oh. Did I not unlock this? Oh. Okay. Was it through here? Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> come out, come out. I dare you to come out. I dare you to come out. I don't think this. <gasps> Hold on, I'm distracted. I'm so distracted right now. Hold on, there's so many things happening. Hold on, there are so many things happening. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm getting overwhelmed. What do I need to do? I need to find the steam crank. But I don't know where that is. And then I also need to give the king the book. But I also don't know where that is. Oh, the king book is there. Okay. Check your inventory. Oh, discarding items. You can discard... Oh, okay. Alright, I'm gonna go put that into storage then. Wow! Wow, 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 wow! Don't need that. <gasps> wow. I'm so confused. Wait, where is the... I s okay, the crank place is also up... Should we do the book first? Maybe we can do the book first. Okay. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Uh, waiting room. Okay. Waiting room. Which was here. And then we go directly out and to the left. Okay. Hello. Rawr. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Don't say anything. Don't you dare say anything. About my aim. Oh my god, my magical girl, my magic, my magical girl era has come! What do I do with it though? What did it say here? Wait. Maho Sozo! Kita! Oh. Oh. Okay. 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 What a jewel. Can I transform yet? Is Leon gonna transform? Okay. I don't know what that does. I was a magical girl for five seconds. What does it do? 
A pricey looking gemstone. Marvin, do you want a gem? Marvin, would you like a gem? Marvin? Not Marvin? Okay. Excuse me. Okay, where was the cranking in? Library. How do I get there? What? How do I get there? Hmm. I mean, I could explore the library. I do hear rah rahs though. What is the ladder? Ew. Don't mind me. Hello. Oh no. I don't like when I fall through things. Ah. Uh -huh. Okay, this is the horse. What's oh, the unicorn? Okay, double fish, lobster, and jug. Double fish, lobster, and jug. A very nice. I got a unicorn! Okay. Now let's go back. Wow! Okay. Ah! I thought I could make that. 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 Oh, I hear Marvin moaning. I would like to heal. Marvin? 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 Two out of three. Okay. I still gotta go through- oh. Let's check upstairs. Okay, so if we go through the library and then we have to go through the How do you get how did I get up there? Was it even in the shower room? Was that where I needed to go? I need... I need... Go through the first floor. 
Oh, I went through here. Right. It was outside the dark room. I went upstairs. Oh. Oh. That way actually might be quicker. Okay. I might die though. Rawr. Herb on the right? Where? 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 Herb? No herb. No herb. I know Leon. All right. Is there a... <gasps> okay. So I go right and then I go up the stairs. Okay. Rawr. You're not allowed to. Oh. No. How did that miss? Bruh. Uh, so go straight. And... Yeah. Oh, also, what am I hearing? Oh no. They did. Okay, crank. Hello. Hello. Why is it saving? Why is it? <sighs> At least give me a heal! God damn it. This is gonna be something in here, isn't it? Can I get a heal? At least? Oh no, it's gonna be... Oh my god, is it gonna be that, like, that, that crawling spider thing that I saw earlier? God damn it! Let's reload. Ah. Ah, yay, yay, yay. Ew! Oh, I did. Oh, I did. I did. I did. Ah, I did! <laughs> Sorry, Leon. That, that was kind of funny. Ooh. 
Can I combine? Oh! I mean, you have an exposed brain. I mean... It must be hard, like, finding your way through the dark. You know? Ew. Are you cleaning yourself? I mean... Whoa. I think my OBS just died. Hold on. I'm sorry. Not really. the door but I don't have the key oh that was locked though oh there was another door not hold up please stay dead oh Location notice. Heat resistant. Three number. Hmm? Move the. Oh! Nine fifteen seven. Wait, nine left. Oh my god, I can't remember this. Nine left fifteen right left. Uh, nine le <laughs> left nine right fifteen left seven nine fifteen seven. I don't know what I need that for, but... No one in here. I feel like someone's in here. Oh, we're safe? Nice. <clears throat> nice. Nice. Anything here I can get? No. Ooh. Interesting. Anything else here I can get? Ooh, Ibuya. 
Oh, I need that. Oh, no, I need that. Oh. Easy. Okay. What was that sound? I don't know what that sound was. Okay. Let's have a look here! Eh? I need to put a disc in? I don't have a disc. Armory door locked! Insert your dongle key! Okay. Well, I don't think there's anything left in this room. I'm gonna have to go back to... The West Wing downstairs. <gasps> there's a new gun! There's a new gun! There's a new gun! Alright. Let's go downstairs. Uh, back into the... Back into the shower room. All the way back down... Oh, there's ammo there. How did I not see there was ammo there? Okay, we go out. We go right. Okay. Wait. Right way. Ooh. Wait, no, there was nothing in there. Oops. Okay. And then we go through there. We go out there. And then we go downstairs. Okay. Ooh, this is a... I can't open that. Wow! Oh, Leon. Sometimes your pain, your pain to size do give remind me that. Oh. Your pain to size kind of relieved the tension a little bit. So I would like to thank you for your service. I went the wrong way. I'm still- I'm still going the wrong way. Oh, it was that room! Safe! Alright, it was, um... Nine... Oh. <laughs> nine! Eh? Okay. Oh. How do safes work? Nine! Fifteen... Seven! <gasps> Amazing. We're doing great. Okay. Now, I would like to go back and save. Where is the last medallion, though? Marvin! I have a full heal! Can I give it to you? Rawr. Rawr. Marvin! 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 Marvin? No, Marvin. Okay. Um, well, I guess... Wait, so I can't get into the... Okay, so I need to find a disc. I'm, I'm guessing there are a lot of things that I need to find in the library. Because I really haven't looked around the library too much. But... Hmm. You never explored the third floor where you first saw Licky Boy. Oh, true! Okay. Um, I'm actually considering of stopping here for today. I feel like I don't want to get too scared. Like, right now, I'm at a good pace where, like, I feel like... 
I can continue playing more next time. You know, I kind of want to pace myself with these Resident Evil 2 streams. Because it's getting a little bit scary. You know? I've used up all my courage. If that makes sense. So I would like to reset for next week. I think it's a good place. Make a, make a personal note. What are we doing next time? We're going to the library in the next time. We should give Licky Boy a name. What did Licky Boy look like? Um... Howie. Howard. Howie for short. Look like a Howie. Also, my OBS is kind of dying. <laughs> anyway. We will go back and visit where we first saw Howie. Um, and then we can also... Um, go to the library next time, but... Hey, I'm having fun! It's not as, um... It's scary. But it's a different kind of scary, I think. I think because there's zombies. And also... I'm try I need to figure out if I can continue playing this one. I should be okay. But... I, I don't know. Because it's the only version that was available on Steam. But anyway, we'll figure it out there next time. Anyway, we're gonna go back and read some Super Chats and uh, Satsu. But that's it for today. Let's go back. Okay. Okay. Exit. Oh my god. This is kind of scary. Oh. Why is my OBS dying? I don't know what happened. Okay, it's back alive. Oh, time to decompress. I am... I... I... My hands are kind of shaking. Like, you know when you, you, you've you just tensed for a really long time and then you untense and then now you're just kind of like a... Uh, yeah, but that's me right now. Yeah. I, but anyway... Thank you so much for watching. <sighs> Even though it took me an hour... <laughs> and I uninstalled a game that made no difference. <laughs> You're much braver than debut, bae. What was the scariest part? Uninstalling the game and realizing I had to wait an hour for it to install again. That's the scariest part of today's playthrough. <laughs> Worrying about perms. That was the... That was the scariest... That was the scariest... But, yeah, I made good progress. Honestly, I didn't think I'd make it that far. I mean, I don't know. I think I'm getting used to it being in the dark now. I don't know. I don't know. Will you get the right version on, on stream for the next time? That's the thing. I don't know if buying a new version would get rid of my save data. If it is, I'm just not playing again, ever. <laughs> I don't know. played the uncensored version was okay. All right. Well, fingers crossed. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. What's wrong with the game? Nothing's wrong with the game. It's just, um, I, I, I just don't want to play a game that I, we don't have permission for or like a certain version of the game we don't have permission for before I double. So I want to double check that we do. Um, because it does, I was looking at the permission that it, it did say something about the, something about a, a gore version not being allowed, but I couldn't, I don't know where that gore version is. And on Steam, 
when I type in biohazard, it's the same one. Like, there's only one version. So I wonder if it's region locked. If it is region locked, then I don't know how... How to get the uncensored... Oh. I don't know. Might have to ask Biju. I don't know how she played the censored version. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how she, she got the censored version. Huh. Anyway. I will double check and I will see. Yeah. Um, I wish they had like a censorship in the in the in the in the settings, but I don't know. We'll see. Yeah. We'll see, we'll see. If it comes down to it, I don't I really don't want to redo this whole thing again, but Ha. Huh. I'm not sure. I don't understand. What does that mean? Oh. I'm gonna have to ask. Okay, because so pretty much they said in the in the permissions, I see that they say uh grotesque version zero zero Z is not allowed. So I was very confused because I don't know what zero Z mean. It turns out it's a it's a age restriction thing. Ah, oh. there's a standard version and a Z version. So the Z version is the one that I can't play, and the standard version I'm guessing was censored. Naruhodo! But the one I bought was standard. I don't understand. <laughs> ah, mo wakannai. I don't know anymore. It's fine. We will make do. We'll see. If I have to replay the thing, I guess I'll have to replay it. Because I do want... <gasps> Ooh, I do want to continue playing it because I feel like it's it's the lore is so interesting. I want to know what happens between Leon and Claire. If I get bonged, I'll say it's because I'm Australian. I'm sorry. And I, I, I'm Australian. I don't understand. <laughs> I'm gonna pull. I'm gonna pull that excuse. I'm I'm from Australia. And I don't I don't understand. <laughs> and I did try. I'm gonna send them this vod and be like, I tried. I uninstalled the game and I reinstalled it and I still got the wrong version. <laughs> things are things are so upside down here that I, I don't like up is down, left is left is right. I don't even know. Okay, okay. <laughs> Just say you read it upside down. No, the game itself is upside down. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. Let's read some super chats. I do want to also read the super chats from um Liza P that I missed a couple days ago. Just so I can um just be somewhat caught up. This week at least. So the list doesn't get too much longer. Because I still need to catch up on the 3D and the karaoke as well. Um, so 
I'm gonna read the lies of P super chats and then I mean no, sorry, I'm gonna read today's super chats and then I'll read lies of P super chats. Yeah. Yes. And also the collab. The collab yesterday as well. Yes, yes, yes. I'll read the three. Yeah. It should be we should yeah, we can we can have a little bit of time. It's fine. Oh my goodness. Sorry, I need to I need to chill for a second because I'm coming down from being tense and being paranoid about open doors. I also have to sleep with headphones tonight because sleeping in the shed, I tend to hear sounds from outside, which is normally just possums running along the roof of my shed. But tonight they're gonna sound very different to me. <laughs> I'm gonna be... I'm gonna be... Watching some... Some ASMR cooking. Watching... You know... With... with on full blast. <laughs> and uh... Yeah. Anyway. Have you guys enjoyed watching... I feel like I'm doing better than people expect. Am I doing better than people expected? Human me. And I am doing it without any moral support as well. I wonder if Liza P has changed me into a gamer. <laughs> You've grown. You seem to hand handle slow moving scary things better. Yeah, because it's slow. <laughs> you can outrun them. <laughs> Except your aim is still not... If you... Anyway. Xiao-san! I saw us! What day is it today? Oh, Friday. Okay, we're good. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot. I, I, <laughs> you know when like you have a really busy week and sometimes you forget what day and then you have like plans on another day and then you just kind of like freak out because you forget what. It's Friday. It's Kyla's 3D day today. Yes, 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 yes. We're fine. Okay. Have you gone outside? Nope. Um, Berserk Knight, thank you. Excited to see you play this game, babe. We're always here by your side, believing in your courage and strength. So come by, a gamer rat. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, B-Faction, thank you. Tashimoto, thank you. Papa Coin, thank you. Wow, getting over it, Liza P, and now this? When did Bay become such a hot gamer girl? Pardon moi? Okay, why is the first reaction... <laughs> Excuse me? Who just scoffed? Excuse me! Excuse me! I literally read that! I processed that! And I read chat and the first common reaction I saw was a scoff! Excuse me! Explain yourself! I'm gonna call you out right now. Who was it? Oh my goodness. I'm gonna call you out. I'm gonna call you out. The fuzzy ducky! Why? I'm gonna call you out right now. <laughs> fuzzy ducky. Explain yourself. <laughs> Why did you scoff? Which part did you scoff at? Did you scoff at the hot part or the gamer part or the girl part? Which part? There are three possible things you could have scoffed at. Can you just, can you just like clarify which part you, you were scoffing at? Yes. <laughs> God damn. I resent you. 
Uh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Mr. Veg, thank you. Salted Bread, thank you. Installing, uninstalling, and reinstalling the same game. This is some next level stalling. <laughs> Ah. Honestly, it wasn't my intention. It really wasn't my intention. Um. <laughs> it, it was not my intention to stall like that, but I would like to say that it kind of is on brand. <laughs> it felt like you planned that. That's how you know you. I'm a professional staller. When stalling just comes, the universe just brings stalling to me. I don't even put stalling into the universe. The universe brings it to me. And the universe knows that Bay needs to stall. You know? <laughs> I'm a V staller. Professional V staller. Wow, we've birthed two nicknames this stream. V texter and V staller. This is great. Did you introduce BG to the FNAF lore? I did. I sent her the entire playlist. <laughs> um, Phil, thank you so much. Sorry to bring... Mm -hmm. Oh no! At least we still have Mrs. Squeak. Oh, I haven't read about that. Eh? Damn. Frozen, thank you! Sure that this stream will go down in the halls of internet history. How though? There is no... There's no... There's no record of it anywhere. There's no record of this stream anywhere. The apples and bananas. No record. You had to be here to witness history. Ugh... <sighs> What stream? Huh? Exactly! The, the apples and bananas are re erased from history. Alright. Orange, thank you. Uh, Alfesta, thank you. The Sickle, thank you. Um, Insanity, thank you. Why Why are there so many bananas? Oh, right. I was like, why are there so many bananas? Right, got you. Um, 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 the sickle, thank you again. Uh, Gabriel, thank you. Crumble Dog, thank you. Insanity, thank you. Darkness, thank you. Matt, thank you. Kwan Yi Song, come down. Aka, Nen, thank you. Yo, yo, thank you so much for the pink super chat again. Boom, boom, boom. At least it was a little longer than the eye tracker revealing stream. Thank you for the karaoke B chatter stream. This is why Bay needs to move to Japan. You're not wrong. Oh, I packed last night. I did some packing. Nothing has changed. <laughs> I feel like I need even more suitcases. I'm so confused. I unpacked and then I packed a little bit. Yeah. And then now I just need to unpack some, some, some more. And then I just need to finish... <laughs> I just need to finish packing, like, one part, and then the other part, and then we're good. Aren't you going back in a month? That's what I packed for! Yeah. How many shoes are you taking with you? So, what I'm planning to do is... So, I have asked Manitan, and Manitan said that they have space for a small suitcase of stuff to be left at their their house, where they live. And then Manitan was like, I can hold on to it for you until you, until you move here. But I only have room for one small suitcase. So you best believe I'm cramming as much stuff in that small suitcase <laughs> as I can. I need to bring... Actually, it's not that much stuff because, like, I just want to bring things that are heavy and, like, that will take space. Right? So, what I'm planning on putting in the small... I want to put my... my udi! My avocado udi! Because I'm going to need it for winter. And then... Um... And that weighs, like, two kilos. <laughs> I need to get, like, one of those air suction bag thingies to compress it. 
And then I want to bring like my big coat. And then I'm gonna bring um uh two uh I'm gonna put uh my my knee high boots, but the 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 flat ones, not the heels ones. I'll put the flat ones in, and I'm gonna bring um another pair of ankle boots. And then if I can squeeze one more thing, I would like to put a pair of heels in there as well, and also a hair straightener slash curler. So, like, three pairs of shoes, an Udi, and a coat. And small things that I find. Please. Please. Your winter is coming in its base suitcases. <laughs> three out of 50 shoes. Actually, no. I'm not bringing... I don't think I want to bring all of my shoes. I'm going to bring... Um, I'm going to bring... Maybe 10 or 12. I'm not gonna bring all of them. <laughs> I'm not gonna bring all of them. <laughs> 10 pairs. I feel like that's reasonable if you're moving to a different country, right? Okay, let's... Okay, I'm gonna count how many I'm gonna bring, okay? I'm gonna bring... Okay, so I have two knee-high boots. One with heels, one without heels. That's two. And then I have one ankle boot, two ankle boot, three ankle boot, four ankle boot. <laughs> five ankle boot, but the five ankle boot is going to... It, it's like breaking, so I'm gonna wear it and then I'm gonna throw it. And then... <laughs> Sneaker, dance sneaker, training sneaker, normal sneaker. <laughs> oh no, okay, hold on. Maybe I don't need those ankle boots. Okay, no. I'm gonna bring. I'm gonna bring two knee high boots, that ankle boot, that ankle boot. And that ankle boot. Okay, three ankle boots and two. Okay, so five boots and then um dance sneaker, normal sneaker, normal sneaker, working sneaker, and then slides. That's ten. Shit. Heel. <laughs> Heel. <laughs> I'll just buy Uggs when I get to Japan. Oh, wait, wait, but I'm wearing one sneaker on the plane, so I, I technically can bring an extra pair. So it's 13 pairs of shoes. Mm -mm. You want me to... Okay, I will make my case. They're all different. Okay, they are all different. First pair of knee-high boots is like... St uh, it's got heels. Okay, so it's fancy. Second knee-high boot is platform. So it's flat. So I can wear it normally. Okay, so it's two, right? And it's like both knee-high. It's two options. Okay. One ankle boot is like... It's like... um, It's like a shiny material. And it's like got a really chunky heel. So I, I wear it to go out. You know, for special occasions. Second ankle boot is um is my sock ankle boot that i bought in japan and it's got a little mini heel that i can wear day to day right but it's like a kitten heel okay and then the third ankle boot is like my everyday kind of ankle boot because it's got a chunky heel and it's comfortable but it's not too high okay five boots all for different reasons okay now i have my dance sneakers that i need for dance it's very specific for dance okay and then i have my slip-on sneakers because easy access you know it's it's you know you can just slip it on and then go and then but those are black so i have a white pair of everyday sneakers as well so i have a dance sneaker a black sneaker a white 
like like white lace-up sneaker and then i have my workout shoes because they have a special kind of insole but to help my insole my, my feet because i have uneven hips so there's four pairs of sneakers and then slides obviously you know you have to have slides and then the two pairs of heels one is a black heel one is a one is a nude heel so you can have that for all different outfits see and then maybe uggs because uggs You buy new shoes in Japan? Actually, I won't. I'm very picky about shoes. Um, and I, I'm very happy with the collection that I have right now. I didn't buy... I only bought the sock heel in Japan because I was planning on getting them anyway. And, and, and I saw them in store and I was like, oh, okay. And I tried them on and they were pretty comfortable, so... What's the sneaker collection like, Bay? I don't have that many. I have uh dance sneakers. I have I have I have black sneakers. I have white sleep uh, the 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 smaller white sneak. Okay, so the dance sneakers are like chunky, right? So I have the chunky dance sneakers, and then I have the black sneakers, and then I have the slim white sneakers, and then I have my training shoes. It's just four. Oh, I also have to bring my. Rock climbing shoes. That doesn't count as shoes. <laughs> so 14. Air Force Ones. Oh, I do have a pair of Air Force Ones, but I don't really wear them that much. Um, No, I have the... Uh, what is it? I've had these for years. It's the white filler, filler chunky sneaker. If you search up filler sneaker, you can kind of, you'll see. It's like the chunky ones. It's like a bit, it's a bit chunky. Yeah. But I have to dance with those because one, they're secure and they have good grip. The grip is kind of like, is actually losing grip. I've had them for like three, four years now. Yeah. The white, the filler white sneakers. Yeah. Yeah, gotta keep stable. Yeah, I tried to... I tried to dance in my training sneakers the other day that I've had for like over six years. And because my... You don't really need grip when you're working out because you're just going to the gym. So I tried to dance in those and I kept slipping and sliding everywhere and I was like, oh gosh. Yeah. You might want to replace them. Really? You're telling me to buy buy more shoes? Excuse me? You, you, are, you tell, are you telling me that I should buy more shoes? Huh? 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 <laughs> Is this... Are you telling me that I need to buy more... Buy more shoes? Oh? Huh? I have been thinking I'm on... I'm on... I've been thinking of getting new sneakers. Because... Because my fellow ones are so old. Like, they don't even tie properly anymore. And, and, but the grip is still like there, so I can technically still wear them, but I was thinking I'm getting, uh -huh. Oh, wait! I need another pair of ankle boots! Sorry. It's four pairs of ankle boots. One was lace up, one isn't lace up. Place the first pair. No! No, 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 no! The one is... One of them doesn't have... Like, it's my everyday boot. One doesn't have a lace-up. One does have a lace-up. The lace-up one goes better with skirts. And the non-lace-up one goes better with pants. You need one for Aussie land as well. Oh, I was just planning on bringing them back. Like bringing some back when I come to visit Australia. What can I say? 
I'm into fashion. I like I like fashion. Does anyone in Hollow Life share the same shoe obsession with you? I know Callie is really into sneakers. Remember one time I went shopping with Callie, and then every single sneaker she saw, she was like, oh, I want it, I want it. And I was like, Callie, no, you don't need it. And then she's like, you're so right. And then five minutes later, we'd see another one. She's like, I need it! And I'm like, Callie, you don't need it. <laughs> Callie says she has like 30 pairs of shoes. I'm telling you, it's normal! 30 pairs is normal. <laughs> I swear to God, it's normal! Bae, you don't need it, but I do. I feel like it's normal. Do you have any designer shoes? No. No. I do not. I have mentioned before that I was... There's one pair of designer... I don't really get the point of designer shoes, in my opinion, just because... They cost so much, but they get dirty because of how dirty the streets are when you go outside, right? So I don't really get that. But there is one pair of designer heels that I've been eyeing for like the last like five years. And I want to... I'm not at a place where I can justify buying it yet because it's very expensive. The YSL heels, yes. So I'm waiting until I get to a point in my life where I'm like, you know what? Yes. I don't feel immense guilt buying the shoes. Is a Dominator gun expensive? How much was a Dominator gun? <laughs> um, I think it's around the same price. Okay, look, okay, the Dominator gun is... Uh, come on, look, okay. The Dominator gun is different though. That's different. That's a collector's item. You know, it's never gonna, it's never gonna come back. The YSL shoes are classic. They're always gonna be on the market, okay? It's different. The Dominator gun is limited edition. I also get a limited edition case, okay? And I can, I can make content from it, okay? It's different. It's a toy. So! It's different. It might come back 10 years later. Nope. I refuse. 20 year anniversary, new Dominator gun. <laughs> Dominator gun top priority. They're really made of gold, babe. Are they? Are they made of gold? I don't actually know. Why is there heels? Uh... Oh my god, it's the same price as the Dominator gun. <laughs> I think the Dominator gun was actually more expensive. <laughs> You could have bought your dream shoe. Oh, please. I would... It's not... I don't think it's gold. I think it's gold toned. Gold toned! I don't think it's actual gold. You walk a thousand dollars on the ground. My point exactly. It's like, why would you get shoes that expensive? You're just gonna get them dirty. You know, the Dominator gun is going to rest beautifully in my home in a glass cabinet on display. Different. <laughs> and also... Exactly! Do the shoes have voice lines from the hit show Psycho Pass? Does the, does the shoes have voice lines from all the characters? Does it come with an, an app? Does it come with a limited edition case? I don't think so. Marketing idea. <laughs> Can it transform into a second phase? I don't think so. 
I don't think so. Do the shoes have, have, have special lights and sounds when it transforms? Don't think so. Thank you. All right. Uh. Someone at YSL gonna take note of these. Next thing you see, YSL X psychopaths. <laughs> ah! Oh my god, YSL X psychopaths would just be Bayonetta. <laughs> Why is that? X Psycho Pass is just Bayonetta! It will just become Bayonetta shoes. Wow. What a revelation. It's genius. Imagine you wearing that while holding your Dominator gun. Bruh. <laughs> um, Ghost of Mouse Count, thank you. Darkness, thank you. Uh, Frozen for thank you. Um, yeah, thank you so much. Save the situation, Brett. This won't happen much after she moves, unless this channel itself is Ian cursed. <laughs> uh, yo, yo, thank you so much for the pink super chat again. Boom, boom, boom. Jimmy Boombox, thank you. I witnessed a lost space. I know what you're talking about. Luke D, thank you. D5, thank you. Toshimoto, thank you. Burn Toast, thank you. Siren, thank you. I just preloaded 80 gigabytes and installed Spider-Man 2 on my PS5 the whole time you were downloading. Yeah. You like flexing on people who are who 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 don't who 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 don't have what you have? Is that what you like doing? Do you also go up to little children who are eating a lollipop and then you buy a bigger lollipop and eat it directly in front of them? Or 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 do you, do you like do you go to like an ice cream store and then you see a child holding like a one scoop ice cream and then you deliberately buy two scoops and like sit right in front of them and eat it? Bet you spent the past five minutes flexing your shoes and your gun. What do you mean? That's not the same! It's not called flexing if the other party doesn't think it's cool! Do you think it's cool that I have 30 pairs of shoes? No, you think I'm an idiot! <laughs> I was kind of flexing my gun though. I know all of you guys want the gun, okay? I'm kind of flexing about the gun, though. I know you guys want the gun. <laughs> At least it isn't keyboards. I may have dabbled in mechanical keyboards. It's also the fastest Iris has ever responded to me. Okay, no, 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 no. Let me just say, I just wanted one build, okay? Because it was kind of like, I've always wanted a mechanical keyboard, okay? And a lot of my friends, like friend Taras, are also really into keyboards. And this was like, even like way before I joined Hololive, a lot of my friends were like into keyboards and stuff like that. Um, so... I just want one build. Because right now, I'm, I, I don't, I'm not using a mechanical, I'm, well, I'm using a, a Razer keyboard, right? But I just want one build. And I'm gonna take it to me, take it with me to Japan, and that's just gonna be my one build. I might buy like keycaps every now and then to like switch off the. But I, I, I'm, I, I promise, just one. I just want one to make it look aesthetic. I just wanted one. I, I seriously don't understand why Iris has so many keyboards. I'm not there yet. Okay, just one. I just want one. 
I just want one, okay? And I built a really good one so that I would tell myself, hey, you spent a lot of money on this one. So you don't need another one. <laughs> A pinky promise from Bait and Promise Group. You know what's really funny? Um, so I was looking at cases. There is a case called the Promise Case. And I nearly bought it. But it was so expensive. And it had like a... A mo... Uh, what is it? A mo moisen... 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 Tame. That the man-made crystal thing. It's called the Promise Case. It's literally called the Promise Case. And I was like, how fitting would that be if I got it? But then I was like, babe, you don't need a crystal on your goddamn keyboard. <laughs> I nearly bought it just for the lore. I didn't get it. Yeah. Because it's also, it's a, it was a full size keyboard. Um, it was a, what do you call it? The T, 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 K, T, K, B? T, K, B? Is not called a TKB. <laughs> TKL. <laughs> Sorry, it's a TKL. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it's a TKL. Yeah, it, it was the it was the one without the keypad on the side. TKL. <laughs> Sorry. Um, no, but I got a, I got a 75 instead. Cause I do, I don't really need, I don't know. Yeah. I think the TKL is a little bit too big for like my aesthetic as well that I was thinking about. <laughs> <laughs> why do you, why are you thinking about TKB? No, I was trying to figure out what it stood for. It was... It was T key something, and I thought it was keyboard, so K KB. I don't know. Okay, I thought it was something keyboard KB. <laughs> so what does TKB stand for? I don't know. <laughs> Ten keyboards. I don't know. I forgot what the T stood for as well. It was T some key something. <laughs> anyway, I would like. To, I'm very happy to inform. Oh, so what happened was, um, so I have a friend Tara who's really, really, really into keyboards, and they have very kindly offered to help build it for me. Yes. So I sent, they were like, oh, just pick out a case, pick out some switches, and then pick out a, the key, the key caps, and I'll build it for you. And I'm like, oh, thank you. And then I was like, oh, friend Haro, I would like, and then when I, you know, sent everything over, and then I, I paid them for everything. I was like, how much is labor fee? And then friend Haro is like, don't worry about it. And I'm like, what? So I treated friend Haro to a very nice meal. I think because there's no uh, there's no soldering. I don't think I don't think Frontier soldered the board, so Frontier said it was easier. I don't know. Based. I think it's Frontier number five or six. Hot swap. Yeah. Yeah. They're hot swap switches. Yeah. But. I got, I got, I have gotten information. I have gotten contact from, what? I've gotten, I've been contacted that my keyboard is nearly done. I think Frentaro has said that it's going to be ready next week. Oh. I'm going to open it. I'm going to take a photo of it. I'm going to send it to Iris. And then I'm going to pack it away and never open it until I move to Japan. Because I don't want to use it here because then I have to like clean it and then repackage it and then take it to Japan. Will you get a photo? Yeah, I'll upload it to the community community tab.
Now you're flexing. Yes. <laughs> Did you get the clicky tile or lin lin linear? I got the linear switches. See, I like thock switches. I like the thocky sound. I like the thock. Hmm. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna take a picture. I'm gonna do like a sound test. And then I'll send it to Iris. I'll upload it. And then I'm gonna repackage it. And then I'm gonna put it in my suitcase. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna do. <sighs> Did you get Hololive keycaps? No, I got... I got the... What was it? The yogurt keycaps? See, I, I think my, my aesthetic is... I like baby blue and baby pink. I like the colors of baby blue and baby pink. So, I got a white case, and then I got, and then I got uh, some yogurt one that had baby blue, had baby pink, it had white, pastel colored keyboard. I think that's that's a good one for a first one. Oh no! I chipped the nail. Uh oh. I went bouldering a couple days ago. Yesterday? No, it wasn't yesterday. The day before. Oh no! Ah, uh, whatever. Bad keyboard? No, it was bouldering. <laughs> I thought I checked. Aw, oh, damn it. My yeah. Dun, dun, dun. We need Thok ASMR when it's ready. Mm. Were you late when you arrived? <laughs> yes, I was. For entire number five was like, ah, oh. I got here like thirty minutes ago, and I was like, oh, I'm I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Did you explain why you were late? Yeah! I was telling Frentara number five. I was like, I'm playing this new game. And they were like, what? And I was like, oh, Lies of P. And they were like, oh, I've never heard of it. And I'm like, it's a Souls-like game. And then they're like, oh, I see. <laughs> Get them to play it. Frontara number five apparently has bought Sekiro. Sekiro? Sekiro. But then they were like, oh, I gave up in like two hours. <laughs> and I was like, is it that hard? Sekiro is great for you because of the parrying. Oh, I love parrying. I do want to try Sekiro next. I was thinking of having just like a Sekiro week to see if I really, if I, because I was having a look at the aesthetic. It's about samurai. It's, it's a similar game style and the graphics look amazing. So I feel like I might be a little bit obsessed with Sekiro when I start it. And it's also set in like, in like the weeb. It's got the weeb setting. It ticks all the tuny boxes for me. I don't know. I feel like I might be really into the game. <laughs> so, I don't know. I guess we're adding Souls like game to the list of weekly games that we're playing. So we have JRPG, we have we have we have Souls like, and then we have Watch Along that still hasn't I haven't started yet. <laughs> after 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 Halloween, just after Halloween, okay? <laughs> the next schedule is gonna be until Halloween. Just I'll tell you that much. And then in uh, November we'll start. I'm 
patiently wait for the FMA care. I'm waiting too. I'm waiting too. It's gonna be spectacular. I don't. I. I. There's nothing I can do about the FMA karaoke. We're waiting for like one final permission check, and that's not on our side. We have to wait for a response, and we just have to keep waiting until they give us a response, which is really. It's unfortunate, but when the day comes, it will be spectacular. Bless you, thank you. Any other Halloween collabs happening? Maybe? Maybe? Yeah. But the next week, I think, um, I wanna, I wanna fin- I wanna see if I can build my pumpkin inside of a pumpkin inside of a pumpkin with a chest with a pumpkin inside in Minecraft. I don't know, I kinda want to. Um... I think we do have collab with Fauna next week, but I'm not really sure. It's been really hard, um, matching our schedules, so I- I can't promise anything, but... We'll- I'll try my best. Um, and then... Uh... We do have a special collab that's happening on Halloween, but it's, it's secret, secret for now. <laughs> it's a secret. Um, and then, uh. am I doing anything else for Halloween? Oh, and then obviously there's Liza P. And then I might start the JoJo watch along if I have time next week. I might not have time next week. And I also want to continue. So ah! Sorry. Fly not now. You're disrupting my stream, okay? <laughs> oh my god, I lost Ken. I don't know where Ken went. Um. Yeah. I'm actually... I'm actually starting... I was, I'm was. i starting to get a little bit worried. <laughs> How many Kens have been lost? Okay. New story about this new Ken. I was actually pretty attached to this, to this Ken. Okay? It was like... I think it was like a younger Ken. So it wasn't as big. It was kind of like a, a medium size. I'm guessing it's like a teenager Ken. But Ken appeared at like my door. It was like a little corner before I entered my door. When I came back from Japan and... Ken was just chilling there. And then I was like, oh my god. Hi, nice to meet you, Ken. And then... Ken stayed there for like two days. And then I kind of got used to... It was kind of being like welcomed home by a pet. And I got kind of got attached. And then a couple days ago, uh, Ken disappeared from the corner and had wandered like along the bottom floor and then reached the little kitchenette. And I was just chilling there. And I was like, oh my god, Ken, you want to move there? Yeah, sure. And I was having... I was, you know... But then, like, yesterday, Ken wasn't there anymore. I even asked Mama Red. I'm like, Mama Red, did you see? Did you perhaps dispose of a spider? And then she was like, what? <laughs> Excuse me? I was like, oh no, I was just I was there and I was just wondering if you did anything. And she's like, no. Oh. Mother, have you seen my pet spider that I just took in randomly? Like a chat with Ken, I was like talking. Oh god, that sounds really sad. I was talking to Ken while I was like prepping tea. I was like asking Ken how his day was, not getting a response. <laughs> and now Ken is gone. I don't know where Ken is. There is a, like a small little hole though, like between the cabinet. So I wonder if Ken just snuck in there and is just like chilling there. Who knows? <laughs> no more Kens when you move to Japan. I know. Man. But it is fine. Oh yeah, reading super chats. Whoopsie. Ah, uh, Watson Cat, thank you. Um, Sickle, thank you. Mike Solar, thank you. So, B, now that the Hollow Life Sports Festival is coming up in the next couple of weeks, are you happy being placed in the yellow team? <gasps> oh, yes! I haven't talked about that yet. Uh, the Hollow Life Sports Festival got announced, and I am very, very happy that I got the opportunity to participate this year as well! 
<laughs> yes. The teams were chosen a couple days ago, and I'm part of the yellow team. Super team again, which is great. And I am part of yellow A, no, yellow B team. Yeah, I'm really excited. There's like, it's, it, I think the divisions are really, really, really interesting. Yeah, so on yellow B team is uh, Hajime chan, Ririka chan, Suisei senpai, uh, Anya, Shiori, and. Me! <laughs> I was like, who's the sixth member? Sorry, me! Me! So I'm really excited. I'm trying to set up some... I'm trying to set up uh, a training things because... Um, and uh, for the EN side as well, because I don't know why they separated into A or B teams. I think it's different... Like, A or B, they will be participating in different races. And, um... Yeah. I want to do my part as... As a good Hollow Ian senpai for Shiori and make sure she is well accustomed and, and she doesn't feel overwhelmed and, and that she understands what's happening and and yes. I think this was too many people. No, I do know I I understand that, but Oh, is it just separate VCs? Oh I see. Oh I see. Right. Right, 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 right. Well, anyway, um, in that case, uh, for the VCs, I guess, well, yeah. Still, still though. Um, I would like to make sure that, you know, she already feels, 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 and, you know, doesn't feel too overwhelmed. But... Um, I haven't gotten any information on the types of games there yet, but we're trying to set up a training session either next week um, or the week after. Do you think you can translate Hajime? No, I don't think I can understand Hajime. I want to collab with Hajime. I want to do um, keep talking, keep talking, exploding game. I want to play that with Hajime. I feel like that'll be really funny. Keep talking and no one explodes. Yeah, and then like she will try to decipher my English and then I can try to decipher her Japanese. I feel like that'd be really funny. But mm. that stream would be like boom boom boom. Ah <laughs> <sighs> But anyway, um, I think that would be that would be a fun idea. But I'm really excited because I haven't spoken to Regloss at all. Um, I've interacted them with Didika on on X like once. She 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 um, tweeted at me, but like, I haven't talked. I haven't spoken to any of them, and I I want to talk to them more. It'll be very interesting. So I'm very excited. Didika is so cute. Nidika reminds me of like an anime character that I've seen before, but I can't put I can't name I can't put a name on it. I don't remember. She reminds me of a very specific anime character from like a shoujo anime that I've seen, but I just don't remember who it is. Martin from My Dress Darling, kind of no, it uh She does look like Martin as well, but I'm trying to... I'm, uh, it's a very specific character. Hmm. Who's also, like, redhead-ish. I don't know. Yeah. But I'm really excited. And also, well... Senpai is also dead. No. I'm gonna be a good senpai and not freak out because... Because other senpai are there. Nope. I'm good. Yes. 
Oh my god. So. <laughs> I'm gonna expose our chat. Um, <laughs> so, <laughs> in our team yellow chat, <laughs> uh, it's always very awkward when you first start, when you're like all added to the chat. No one wants to be the first person to message. And it's like, what do you message about, right? So, I got a notification that in our team yellow chat, and this is like everyone, like team yellow A and B, right? <laughs> And I got a notification, and Porika Senpai messaged, "Kiro to itara pineapple," which means when you think of yellow, it's a pineapple. And I was like, "Huh?" <laughs> no context, nothing. What a what an icebreaker! So I followed up a minute later, and I was like, "Pineapple to itara pen." Which means, when you think of pineapple, you think of pen. And then Watame Senpai goes, pen, pineapple. Dot dot dot. <laughs> <laughs> and then I respond in English, apple pen. <laughs> ah, why are we like this? Have any of the other chats said anything? Hold on. Oh, I can't look at their chats. God damn it! <laughs> Yellow chat sounds fun! Yeah! <laughs> no spying! True. But, yeah, that was really funny. I'm really excited. Uh, I don't really know any of the games that are happening this year, so I need to, I need to, I need to educate myself on the Minecraft games for this year before, before we start training. But it does seem really fun. There, uh, I had a little glimpse at the introduction stream that happened on Miko Senpai's channel. But they seem really fun and they're all new this year as well. Yeah. Very excited. So that's happening on the 4th of November JST, so 3rd of November PDT. Um, it's gonna be... it's like pretty much right after Halloween. So we're gonna finish Halloween, and then we've got that, and then we've got like a week of, 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 of streams, and then um, I think I'm going to Japan. <laughs> I may be going to Japan. <laughs> um, and then... Um, yeah. Yeah, I... Uh, things aren't gonna be stable for a while. Like, I have this thing in my head. I think December might be more stable in the sense of, like, I will be, like, you know, I have more consist quote-unquote consistent streams. I mean, I have more consistent streams when, I back when I'm back in the shed, just because I'm obviously back in the shed. But I think December will be where I finally start... <laughs> Jojo. I just need to finish Season 1 Jojo by February. That's all I need to do. Any plans about 800? We're close to 800? What? I thought we still had a little while to go. <laughs> huh? We're at 793. That's still a while. I don't have the brain capacity! 7k off? Please, that could take like two, two months. It's fine. <laughs> Um, but I wanted to say now, so after we have a very packed week this week until the end, uh, until, 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 um, Halloween. Um, and then I'll have like two weeks of like normal streams. Maybe we can start Jojo, uh, and, and, and hopefully finish. I don't know if I can finish Lies of Peeve. I probably won't be able to, um, before I leave for Japan. And in the two weeks of Japan, I literally have recording. I feel like every single day. <laughs> Every single, or nearly every single day. Those two weeks are literally just recording hell for me. Um, if it's not recording, I have dance lessons. If I don't have dance lessons, I have recording. So, you know, I, I literally, those two weeks are, I have, I have to go back to 
just work on that stuff, you know? Um, so I will not be bringing my, my, my laptop this time, gaming laptop, just because, um, I don't think I need it. And also I'm not, I'm staying in like a hotel situation. So I'm just gonna ask to use the studio and check in. I will check in every now and then, maybe like two streams a week, but I don't think it'll be gaming. Um, I might, I will see if I can do like off collabs maybe and stuff like that, if I can organize that, but I don't think I'll be gaming that too much in those two weeks. Um, yes. Just lights up just here and there, just to check in with you guys and just to let you know that I'm alive. <laughs> Will we get a V-spacer? I might do a, a bath V-space maybe, because it's getting cold, you know? But we'll see. So for those two weeks, I, I request for your understanding. Thank you very much. And um, I'll be back in December. With hopefully more stable streams, and then we've got Christmas. Oh my goodness, it's Christmas. Where did this year go? Uh. Dude, it's almost 2020. Oh shit, it's almost 2024. I'm literally on the verge. Like, I don't regret starting for Bayry, but I do resent past base slightly for not thinking how much pressure it would be when 2024 actually arrived. <laughs> I resent her ever so slightly. Okay? And I think I resent her ever so slightly because I don't think past Bay ever thought that 2024 would come. You know? So... Have you started planning for bear? Oh yes, planning has, has been well, well, it's it's well on its way. Still got a lot that I need to figure out, but oh my goodness, past bay underestimated time. She really did. We told you to start planning. I'm making. I need to make a disclaimer right here, right now. I'm gonna put one thousand percent effort into February 2024. And then for February 2025, I'm gonna put zero effort. I don't care what anyone says. I'm not doing shit for 2025. <laughs> Sekiro 20, Se Sekiro 28 days. Okay. That's what we're gonna do. <laughs> The Barry 2025 is going to be filler. Maybe you should cancel for Barry after that. I feel... Mm. This is you we're talking about. I don't know, bro. Maybe just take a vacation. I'll just not stream the entire Fe February. <laughs> I just dip. I just disappear. <laughs> Evens it out. My god. One month, zero streams. Bro. I don't think I could do that. <laughs> 13 changes a rat. It really does. Anyway, it is traditional. Uh, let's be real. I probably will still do for Barry, but... I just, it's going to be very, very low effort compared to 2024 because 2024, I feel like, you know, it's, it's, it's my first birthday. Crazy. Yeah, but get ex I'm excited for 2024. I feel like 2024 is going to be my year for obvious reasons because I'm actually, I, I, I actually exist in 2024. <laughs> Um, but I finally turn one. Yeah. <clears throat> you did a lot this year, though. I feel like, see, 2023, I did a lot as well. But I feel like 2023 was like, was like the, was like the uh, lead up. Was like the prelude. 
prelude prelude did i say prelude pre prelude it's the appetizer year it's the training arc it's the pre-game show <laughs> it's the warm-up 2023 was the warm-up year for 2024 is what i was i is what i feel <laughs> yeah If so, 2024 would just be pure chaos. Lore accurate. <laughs> uh, Dr. Professor, thank you. Fluffy Shinigami, thank you. Otaku Realist, thank you. <laughs> um, Yelling God, thank you. Super Zero, thank you. Perfection, thank you for the super chats. Thank you. Watch it go. Boom. <laughs> Did you say Promise got lore updates? Oh, is it up already? I know we were getting them. I, I know that they were updating them today, but I didn't know. Are they up already? Talent. Lore update. Let's have a look. Promise! Let's read them all, shall we? Iris. Iris, it's Iris, your say-so Nephilim here to fill the world with hopium. A Nephilim who was once the embodiment of hope back in the paradise. What? <laughs> What's the paradise? While she is left to set off on an adventure, she continues to deliver hope through her lyrics and song with determination in her voice. Ooh! Nice! I kind of X on the say-so part though. She also bears the precarious and unstable due nature of a half-demon and half-angel. This phenomenon can be observed on rare occasions in the form of the most unpredictably yeah, but, um, surprising comments from Iris herself. Hey! It's accurate. Oh my god. Bewildering those around her is but another unexpected charm of her duality. Hey! Oh my god. It actually fits. It fits now! Oh my god! Accurate lore? Amazing. Alright, let's check the other ones. Kampana! Your gaming idol Kirin Ceres Fauna is here. The keeper of nature, a dru a druidic Kirin who appeared on the internet to win over humans and convince them to return to nature. She will attempt to charm you with her soft voice, comforting presence, and surprisingly deep knowledge of cursed memes. But be wary because she has a reputation for turning people into trees. Huh? Once you enter her forest, you won't want to leave. Ooh, I like that last line. Nice. Crony. Cronichiwa, it's me, perfection. Also synonymous, syn synonymous, syn synony synony synonymous for Oro Crony. Damn. Time is an unwavering, precise entity, and its warden is its overseer, is equally cool and impeccable. Occasionally, her exquisiteness leads her to decisions, and bouts of luck that transcend the understandings of mere mortals. Oh my god, why does this fit so perfectly? <laughs> However, even utmost perfection finds no foothold in the face of her mortal enemy, Disorder. Me? What? That's kind of law. That's kind. That's very law accurate. Damn. Okay, these are. I'm not gonna say they're. They're, they're more. I'm gonna say they're more fitting towards us than our previous law descriptions. Mume. Oh hi. Who's this? Nanashi Mume. Cute. The guardian of civilization, a traveling owl who has borne witness to numerous events, even though glimpses of past memories seen and forgotten. Throughout her endless journey, occasionally surface, she's now a lovely girl. <laughs> Who relishes each and every day. Hey, Mimi, did you hear that? You're a lovely girl. You're, you're a lovely girl. You're a lovely girl. Um, who relishes each and every day. When once she was just an observer, she now enjoys her everyday interactions with civilizations and its people. Soon the ordinary, ever-present daily life shall also weave itself into the tapestry of civilization. That one is nice. Fits, fits, fits. And there's mine! Da, 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 da. 
Are you surprised with how short it is? Chaos, mayhem, entropy. All in the form of a cute little rat. She's a performer looking for her next stage. Occasionally, she'll get swept up in her own storm. But that's just part of the fun. Yeah. That intro is wrong. What's up? It's your worldwide... Worldwide rat idol. <laughs> okay, no. Did she... No. No, 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 no. We all know the quote could be longer. No, okay. You know what? I feel like... This is like a PR, this is like a PR introduction. All right, this is fine. Which one is the real one? Okay, look, I'm proud of my, it needs the steel rose introduction. No, okay. I would like to say I specifically requested for this, what this lore description to be short to the point. And I wanted to be, I wanted to be, you know, more general because honestly, even with my original lore, you know, the gods never gave me much of a purpose. They were just like chaos in rat form. There, have fun. That's all they said to me, okay? I was no I was not given any duties. You know. And besides, this is just a quote. It's not technically my introduction. You know? It's different. This is like an introductory this is like an introductory page. So you know what? Hmm. I wanted, I wanted something more general. And, you know, self-explanatory. But how they can, but how can they get to know you without the stilt by watching my stream? You know, someone who doesn't know, like, know me, goes to the website and be like, Oh my god, I want to read up more, I want to read more about Bell's Hikos. And then they read, What's up? It's your world wide rat idol, Bell Hikos. Oh my god, wait, she's an idol and she's a rat? Interesting. Chaos, mayhem, entropy, all in the form of a cute little rat. Oh, she's like a chaotic little rat. Okay. And then you read the next. She's a performer looking for her next stage. Oh, okay, she likes performing. I see. She's a performance major. Nanohoda. Occasionally, she'll get swept up in her own storm, but that's just part of the fun. Or maybe she gets like, you know, a little swept up. She gets a little bit too excited or she gives a, you know, it looks like she's she's more excited, right? And then they come to my streams, and what do they hear? What's up? I am chaos! The end of ends! A steel rose trapped in a cage of ice. Your best friend. Holly Ian. Huckles Benz. It's part of the theatrics, people. You can't give away the theatrics in the book description. You gotta read the book. You don't go to a play, okay? This is just the blurb. It tells you in the blurb that she is a performer. And what do you get when you go to her streams? A performance! <laughs> it's the fourth time you said your intro today. I just want to practice more, okay? Witness me. I forgot that part. Oops. Uh, could you tell the staff to, they need to fix your hashtags because they're wrong. Oh, yeah. So I put in the request to fix the hashtags in a really a while ago. And I got an update that say they're just a little bit uh, behind. Um, like the backlogs are a little bit behind, but they will get to it as soon as possible. But it is in. The request to change the hashtags to the new hashtags is in. We just got to wait a little bit. That's all. Yeah. And also, it's kind of my fault that I changed my hashtags. Let's be real. I don't think anyone really changed the hashtags. So it's kind of on me. Okay. Sorry. Now all that's left is a YouTube banner. Oh, okay. So <clears throat> um, you may see uh, the other promise talents getting uh, like banner updates. I asked, I didn't, I asked that. Management asked if we wanted one, like designed from the company. And I politely rejected. Um, I've always wanted to make my own banner. So I think that's what I'm gonna tr I'm gonna commission my own. Um, so you're gonna keep it OG? No, I'm not gonna keep the OG. I'm gonna I'm gonna commission my own just so that I I kind of want art. I want a custom banner. Um, so 
yeah i'm gonna if you see that my banner hasn't changed it's because i'm still in the process of, of getting a new one like for myself even if the others change it so thank god you aren't drawing it Challenge accepted. <laughs> can you imagine? Oh my god, can you imagine? It's like company designed banner, company designed banner, company designed banner, company designed banner. I was like, call self artistic figure banner. I'm kidding. No. I actually want... I, in my head, I want like a really tuny style banner. Like, like I want Bay looking as tuny as F. And I want like a steel rose pendant. I want... I want the... I want the theme to be steel rose in eyes. <laughs> That's the hint. That's the hint for new viewers. I want the theme to be steel. I want to see chains. I want to see steel bars. I want to see a black rose that is wilting. Anyway. So many tangents today. Um, Drakina the human. Thank you so much for the pink super chat. Boom, boom. Whenever there is downtime, I get a random voice line in a random language involving my username. Drakina the human. Vaga Tomoyo. Drakina the human. Scarasite. Nakama ni nare. I don't know where that came from. Seven, thank you. Remember this tip when maneuvering around the game zombies. Shoot. Then Nico Nico kneecaps, and you'll find it very effective for getting away. Ooh! That's actually good advice. I will try that. Instead of headshot, knee shot. Um, dog, thank you. Uh, Saki san, I zamas. Nihoma, ima, o hiru desu. Kyo mo, kawaii zo. Kambare. I zamas. Uh, yoyoi, thank you again. Uh, perfection, thank you. Uh, insan, thank you. Buffy, baby, thank you. Thank you, thank you. All right. Uh, let's read the lies of P Super Chats. GP the knee. Ian this. Uh, Shio Saizamas. The sickle, thank you so much. Uh, Draconic, thank you so much. Uh, Lev S, thank you. Phantom, thank you. Nihon ni kitara. Hai shin jikan. Might want to refresh. Oh, did I miss some? Oh, I did. Oh, I missed a lot. Oh, I'm so sorry. Um. Hmm. Uh, okay, sorry. Going back to today's super chats. Waffle, thank you so much. How's ahoy? Thank you. Ah! Outrun the wind, thank you. Yoyoi, thank you. Fire duck, thank you. Tip down the chocolate, thank you. It was a really great run today. You were a lot less scared than expected. Looking forward to seeing more of it. Thank you. Uh, Tony Bombuza, thank you. Al Kusanagi, thank you. Renata, thank you. What makes the game scary is the music. It's meant to scare you. Ah, oh. that is true. It's the it's the it's the sound that is is more scary. Um, Omar 
thank you. Darkness, thank you. I wanted to give you a token of courage for doing so well today. Liza P really shapes you into being better at gaming. By the way, I look forward to your yellow B team at the upcoming sports festival. C says with you too. Yes. Yes. Caffeine, thank you. Base shoe funds. Oh, please, you don't want you you don't want to be funding that. That's the last fund you should be funding. Nope. 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 Here it's faces, thank you. Uh Big Nick, thank you. Shoe funding. Nope. Wanna refund? Nope. Just watch me. <laughs> Walton Cass, thank you so much for the pink of a gem. Boom boom boom! Sorry, but I spoke to my fashion niece's sister about your shoes. She says 16 pairs is not normal. Yeah, 30 pairs is normal. 16 pairs is not normal. Why you so no come sound me da? Thank you. Kaima, thank you. Uh, Rick, ooh, thank you. Hi, thank you, Rick. We're going there? We're going... We're, 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 we're going there again? Are we going there? Calm yourself, babe. Calm yourself. Kureji Kara, thank you! Um, yo, but now that your lore changed, are you and the girl still gods? Yes, we are. Yes, we are. I am god. We are all still gods. It's, think about it, like, our original lore doesn't change. You know, warden of time, keeper of nature, guardian of civilization, you know, chaos. Nothing of it, nothing changes. It's just, we're going on a new adventure. It's like a DLC. <laughs> it's a DLC lore, you know? <laughs> so you're just gods that quit their jobs? No, we're just going on a little vacation! <laughs> Promise is DLC, pretty much. Filler arc. It's the filler arc that beca that becomes the main arc. Mm. It's just a new chapter. Yeah, exactly. Um, Effa, thank you. Walton Cats, thank you. My sister says six pairs are normal. When I told her you had 30, she said get some help. If you can survive with six pairs, I tip my hat to you. You must be a very... Efficient dresser? I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. Um, okay, now back to the lies of P. Um, super chats, thank you, thank you. Levis, thank you. Phantom, thank you. Hip hip free, thank you. Two pair gang, three pair gang. Okay, see, maybe I'm a little... I. It's different if you don't enjoy shoes, though. Like, if you don't have... I'm sure everyone has a hobby in their life that, you know, you like collecting. Say for Iris, it's keyboards. I'm just like, why do you need so many keyboards? And she'll be like, the case is different. The switch is different. Everything is different. And I'm like, but it's the same. It's still a keyboard. It's the same for shoes. You may think that 30 pairs of shoes is excessive, but they're all different. You know? They're all different. She also needs to get some help. I don't argue with that. That is probably true. <laughs> I'm sure everyone has a collection of something. What is the collection that you have? What do you collect? Tell me. In chat right now. What do you collect? Books? They're all the same! Acrylic figures, they're all the same! <laughs> it's still a book! <laughs> How dare you say books are all the same? <laughs> Book 
socks are a way better use than a shoe. Hmm. I, I suppose. <laughs> Rick Reardon books? Okay, I collect Rick Reardon books too. Books can be used as a weapon too. And you're saying shoes can't. You know, that was an episode of Criminal Minds. Um, and I think it's called If the Shoe Fits. Is it literally about an avenging Cinderella who uses a stiletto to like stab people in the neck? I'm just saying. I'm just saying. How impractical. <laughs> What's your favorite book? Ooh. Magic Kittens. <laughs> um, Walt, thank you. Mr. Vesh, thank you. Tibble, thank you. You may not know your left from your right, but you do know the way down. Thank you. Frozen, thank you. Um, Rick, thank you. Grumbledore, thank you. Yoko, thank you. He eats faces, thank you. Alphestus, thank you. Half and half, thank you. Retry of Heal Guy, thank you. Um, A, thank you. Steve, thank you. Waffle, thank you. Copybara, thank you. Poor Dachi, Kamsamida. Move laser, thank you. Lililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililil
I don't think that's legal in Japan. Still kind of icky, but we're just gonna forget. Just pretend that they are not that aged, okay? Anyway, I'm gonna reread it. The story itself, like, I just can't get past the age. Just, I just, I always ignore the age portion because that just, you know, puts a really bad taste in my mouth, okay? So, you know, we just ignore the age, ignore the gross part, and then just focus on the actual story because let's be real, she doesn't look 17. None of these anime characters ever look their age, okay? It's like, take the new Sailor Moon remake for example. This is gonna be a rant. How does 14-year-old Usagi look like that in the new Sailor Moon remake? It doesn't make sense, okay? She barely looked 14 in the original, and now she looks like a 25-year-old in the... I'm fine. I am fine. Everything fine. <sighs> Let it out, babe. You don't understand. Okay, if you look up Sailor Moon original. Okay, yes, like her personality and everything reminded you of 14 year old, you know, the original um, artwork. She kind of, she doesn't look 14. Like you look at that outfit. Who's wearing that? 14 year old, excuse me. Like who has that kind of style at 14? Who has that kind of figure at 14? Okay. Like you have, you're 90% leg at 14. That doesn't, that doesn't make what? Anyway. The original 14 year old, okay, fine. You know, it's the style, she still looks cute and her personality reminds you of a 14 year old kid. That is fine. Then you see the new goddamn remake. I would like to say, I'm not coming for the artwork. The art style is mwah, it's beautiful, okay? The animation is beautiful. The art is beautiful. I'm just saying that she doesn't look 14. She looks like the moon princess who is like an adult. <laughs> she looks like an adult. She's so beautiful, but she looks like an adult. <sighs> anyway. Anyway. Like, literally, when Chibi Moon comes in, like, Sailor Moon and Tuxedo Mask could literally pass as her parents. In reality. Not even in the... There is a problem where if, like, your... <laughs> There's a problem if your reincarnation looks exactly the same as you when you are, like... I don't even know how many years they're apart. Usagi is supposed to be 14. The moon princess is like in her goddamn 30s, okay? If they look exactly the same, there is a problem. <laughs> Remember Kanata from Lucky Star? At least she looks her age! Oh god. Okay. It's fine. It's fine, okay? Even Kagome doesn't look like Kikyo. Exactly! Because Kagome is a ninth grader, which honestly, I have my own gripes with Kagome. I remember thinking back on the realistics of, of like Inuyasha and how ridiculous it is. But anyway, that's because Kagome was a ninth grader. Kikyo was like in her 20s. No, she wasn't. She was 17. Okay. Like technically they're the same age, but like they're from different like... Wait, they are the same age. Look! Kikyo and Kagome were the same age and they still don't look exactly the same. How old was Inuyasha? Inuyasha was 17 years old. <laughs> Can you believe that? <laughs> Can you believe Inuyasha was 17 years old? No, Kagome was 15! There we go, Kagome was 15, Inuyasha was 17, Kikyo was the same age as Inuyasha who was also 17. There we go! Yes! Yeah, if you didn't know, like, if you, like, Obviously, Inuyasha and all the demons have their own way of aging, but like if you equivalent it to human years, it's it's known that Inuyasha is 17 years old. And I think Sashomaru is like 23. That's so super strange when you put it like that, because it's like bro-wise, everyone's so young. <laughs> Sashomaru is almost 23! Isn't that crazy? He seemed like a like a 30-year-old, like grumpy old man. 
he looks and acts like he's in his 30s. Yeah, he's like 23. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> yeah. He's an old soul. Um, but that was another thing I, I, I remember, like, after rewatching Inuyasha for so many times, I realized she was away from home for, like, months and months and months at a time, and she only had the school uniform. She never changed out of her school uniform. Her hair never grew, you know? Like, she, she was never cold. <laughs> <laughs> and she would be like thrown everywhere and her clothes wouldn't break imagine the smell okay i'm sorry like i know this is like feudal feudal japan and i'm sure they stopped by lakes every now and again there were some like bathing scenes i suppose but like imagine the stink Like, even Sango had a change of clothes. Like, Kagome, come on. Like, you went back home and you didn't think to yourself that you would bring extra... Funny, she wears different clothes when she's back home, but she always wears the same outfit wherever, whenever she goes into the past. I don't understand. Like, even Sango had an outfit for fighting and an outfit for normal travel. Kagome, what are you doing? <laughs> Hi, Shioring! I don't know what's happening. Um, we are having a tangent zatsu about anime, but... <laughs> but, I know, like, obviously don't take what I'm taking seriously, but I'm just like, it, this, it's just the things that you think about, right? That make it even more funny, in my opinion. Don't take anything that I'm saying seriously, okay? Okay? I'm not actually mad. I'm just kind of ironically mad, okay? <laughs> it started with shoes. <laughs> it's the same thing as questioning why anime characters never go to the bathroom. So true. Ugh. It started with shoes. It all started with shoes. Kagame should have taken 16 shoes with her. Oh. I will say one of my most like one of the most heartwarming scenes from Inuyasha that I would definitely do if I was in her in her position was like she brought back like snacks from like obviously modern day back to like feudal Japan. I would totally do that. Oh my goodness. I'd be like, hey, yo, what do you want? I got to show you the beauty of like modern day snacks. I love that scene. I love that scene. It's like Shippo got like cookies and then Mirok-sama got like noodles and like, you know, Inuyasha got like potato chips and like instant ramen. Bro, I would so do that. And like her, her, her med kit as well. The culture shock. It's, oh, I would so do that. I wouldn't bring anything useful. I'll just bring like an entire bag full of snacks. And then Mama Rat would also be like Kagome's mother who would like just like make food, like lunch boxes for everyone. <laughs> oh my god. That's the most realistic scene that's ever happened in in, in Inuyasha. If you were in that situation, you would 100% do the same thing. Just pack food. Have you watched Yasuhime yet? No. I've watched, actually no, I've watched season one, have not watched season two, but I did watch spoiler scenes off YouTube and I cried like a baby. <laughs> I watched the spoiler scene where Mohora, Mo, Mo, Moroha meets Kagome and Inuyasha again, and I cried like a baby. And I would like to attribute 70% of that to the fact that they used the original BGM from the original anime, okay? And just seeing Inuyasha act like a dad, bro, just in the feels. It's bad. It's it's bad. It is bad. Like, I would like to give credit to Yasuhime. That scene was very touching. It was indeed.
So, yeah. But I haven't watched Yashima. I don't plan to. Does Kagome still look like a ninth grader? They both, they both look the same. No one has aged. <laughs> that actually might be part of the plot, though. Like, I, I don't actually don't know what's happening in Yashihime, but I know they're, like, trapped somewhere. That, so that actually might be canon of, like, you know, they're stuck in time. So that's why they don't age. So I'm not going to give them any shit for that. She did get new clothes, though. <laughs> yeah. I think they were in a time warp, so I'm not going to... I'm not going to say anything about that. So it's fine. <laughs> She did change clothes. She did change clothes. <laughs> she breaks out a new wardrobe every 10 years. Bro. Inuyasha, you're gonna take some notes from Sashomaru. Did you see the ending of Inuyasha final act? Sashomaru would drop off like a new kimono for Rin every couple of months or something. Bruh. Inuyasha, take some notes. Kagome be like on the same, in the same Miko outfit for the last how many years? <laughs> anyway, Murph Laser, thank you. Where am I up to? Frozen Fox, thank you. Zethus, thank you. Renee, thank you. Darkness, thank you. Insanity, thank you. Buffy Bebe, thank you. Konisan, kamsamida. Thank you. Okay, I promise book club after I come back from Japan. The book club is going to consist of Magic Kittens and Vivi Rose. Those two other ones, I'm going to reread Vivi Rose and I'm going to read and I'm going to read Magic Kittens. That's going to happen. I'm actually really excited. I re I've read Vivi Rose I think like twice now. And the reason why I read I read it is because like everyone is just so pretty. The artwork is just so pretty. Everyone is so pretty. You know, like pretty girl meets pretty boy and like all their friends are really pretty. <laughs> everyone is just so pretty and like everyone is so it's like talented at what they do as well um so a little bit of like a little bit of a a, a blurb about what bb rose is about it's about a high school girl who's like really really pretty and she makes um handbags she's really really good with her hands like she makes really pretty handbags um and it started as a hobby whatever and then um she meets these two fashion designers and they're like in their young 20s and they're also really really pretty boys <laughs> not bb rose no v v for velcro b for bay v b rose that's what it's called yeah everyone is really pretty anyway so there's two of these these two fashion designers who are like in the young 20s and they are also like they they're also like re really pretty and they're also best friends and they run like this fashion, this fashion designer, this fashion line, and they helped design the wedding dress for the main girl's sister. And then that's how they met. And then this is an entire story of like them, them getting to know each other. And then like there's the business. Oh, hi, bug. Why are you okay? Fly somewhere else. 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 Do you see what I mean? They're so pretty. The eyes, the way the eyes are drawn. Bruh. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, that was, that was a mosquito. <laughs> I'm sorry you saw that on stream. It was a mosquito. I apologize. <laughs> that was the sound of death. <laughs> the volume covers are really pretty, right? It's something about the art. It's the, okay when I when I re read Baby Rose, the way they draw like the legs and the way they draw the eyes. If you look at the eyes, it's like a very it's like a more olden like style of art. But like the hair, also the outfits on point. The hair, the eyes, the outfits, everything, because I think it's a, obviously a fashion-based, like, manga. It's really, really pretty. Anyway, so that's one. There's another one that is, like, god damn, like, what the heck? Like, drama. 
What was the code? Was the code the one? Ah. Oh. Yes! It's called the one! Oh my god. I think it's a manhua, actually. I don't know. Bro. I read the one. If you search up the one, bro, that shit crazy. That shit crazy. There's like over a hundred something chapters. Drama filled heaven. It's actually kind of fucked up, but like, bro. It's crazy. It's it's a, it's a, it's it's one that is it's about a, a model. Is it BL? No, it's not BL. Type in the one manga. It's a manhwa. Is it? It's a manga. The art is also really good. I think it because it's also based on fashion. It's about modeling, and yo, the story be effed up, but bruh, it's so. It was like, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. How did this happen? Yeah, she has a top hat. Yeah, that one. Yeah. It's crazy. It's a really fancy art style. Yeah, you don't really see it. You don't really see it much anymore but it's it's very yeah it's crazy anyway i really want to do like a retelling of the one as well because yo that shit insane but we're gonna start lukewarm first like bb rose is like more of a cute like romance fluffy there is some drama but like not too much it's not too bad it's really cutesy um and then we'll dig into the one okay thank you very much all right um insanity thank you buffy baby thank you clangy song come tell me okay um and then we'll always just have one more we have a couple more from the collab yesterday with bibu i mean biju course like biju did you guys enjoy it yesterday i really i had so much fun with biju <laughs> um i i think ever since she debuted i kind of expected like us to get along pretty well because when I've been when I've been watching her stream, she's very similar. We have similar brain cells. <laughs> Sorry, I was very excited when we collabed yesterday, and I'm really happy that um, you know, it was what I expected. You have to call her Kosuki Biju. Yeah, yo, I'm one upping Kiwawa. Kiwawa calls me Bells. I'm gonna call Biju Kosuki Biju every single time. It's full name basis only. <laughs> Watch me. It rolls off the tongue so well. Cause it can be you. It's gonna die by the next collab. Oh, you just wait and see. Cause it can be you. <laughs> If I ever call her Bibu, then Batsu. Yeah, okay. Hold me to it. I will never say Bibu ever again. It's Koseki Biju from now on. All right. Thank you very much. Uh, Autumn Cat, thank you so much. Justin, thank you. Free Faction, thank you. Uh, Darkness, thank you. And Buffy Bebe, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Write that down, bruh. Have I Zatsu for two hours? <laughs> Damn. It all started from shoes. Anyway. <laughs> I think I Zatsu longer than the game today. <laughs> Oopsie. He's fine. Anyway. I hope you guys enjoyed today's stream. Uh, no stream tomorrow. I'm going to take a day off tomorrow. And then I'll see you guys on Sunday for the Promise collab that's happening on iWiss's channel. We're going to be playing Family Feud. I'm very excited. I'm very, very excited. 
I don't think I've ever played Family Feud before. I've watched it, but I don't think I've ever played it before. It's just you have to guess, right? Certain things. So it's going to be really fun. I think it's going to be really fun. And it's going to be the first techno... Like technically the first... Well, if you don't count the 3D collab. It's going to be the first Promise collab. Yeah! You have to guess how people responded to prompts. Okay, right. And hold on there. Wait. That's all for today! Are there gonna be an announcement? Yes! Why, yes! Announcement! I'm so glad that you asked. Um, the Hello Promise 3D really acrylic stands is still currently for sale. The link's in the description below. And while you're at the, while you're at the store already, you know, adding, clicking the Add to Cart button, why not check out the, the 3D Celebration merch that is also currently for sale? Yes, there is a very, very... There's a wide range of merchandise, but the one I want you to pay attention to is the very cool T-shirt that's on the end right there. Yeah, the Street Rat T-shirt that is designed by yours truly. I took a little nibble out of it during designing as well, because yours truly got a little bit hungry. So, please, if you are interested, check it out. You'll regret it if you don't. Um, other announcements will uh, include Kyla's 3D is today, tonight. You better go watch. I'm definitely going to be watching. And that's about it. Also, Callie has a new song coming out. It's a collab with Metal Gear, which is goddamn crazy. I still haven't wrapped my mind around the fact that that's happened. I, I, well, I don't, I, I don't know what Metal Gear is, but I'm guessing it's a game, and I know she's a really big fan of the game. But that's huge. It's insane. You don't even know what Metal Gear is. I don't know what it is, but I have heard of it. But the fact that. Callie is collabing, and I know it's one of like she really likes it as well, so it's huge. It's huge. You don't have any idea how huge. Give me an example so I know how huge it is. I just know it's big. Metal Gear is like Street Fighter famous. Oh! Metal Gear is like Sonic. Whoa! It's as popular as Naruto. One of the biggest franchises ever. Whoa! Kelly! Oh, that's crazy. Oh, that's crazy. Oh my goodness. Callie be, Callie be cooking. Well, it's coming out, I think, today in a couple hours. So make sure you do check that out. Yes. But that's it for announcements today. I don't think I have anything else. Um, I'll see you guys at the collab. Yeah, have you had a good time today? I had a banger time. And I'm gonna go charge up my... I kind of want to reread Vivi-verse now. <laughs> you got a book club next week? No, it's not scary enough. Actually, what is more terrifying than romance? Let's be real. Will the uh, schedule be posted next week? Yes, it will be posted next week. Yes, indeed. That was too real. Maybe I can do it next week, honestly. I just need to read Magic Kittens again. I kind of remember what happens in BB Rose, like, kind of, but like, not really. But we'll see. BB Rose is kind of long. BB Rose has like 70 something chapters. But Magic Kittens, you can't, you just can't rush through Magic Kittens. We'll see. Alrighty. Anyway, that's all for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Is anyone else still streaming? Yeah, don't.
and redirect somewhere. No? Okay. Well, in that case, we'll redirect to... Kyla's 3D! If I can. Kyla. Ready? Oh, no. She hasn't opened her redirects. It's fine. Okay. Well, I guess that's it. You can manually redirect to Kyla's stream then. Yes. Everybody, be sure to check it out. I'm very excited. Yes. Anyway. Thank you so much. Or maybe Callie's song then. Oh. You right. Alright, we're gonna raid into Callie's new song uh, premiere. That's happening in three hours. Yes. Okay. We'll do that. Okay. Thank you, everybody. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, but that's it for today. I will talk to you guys next time. Um. Yeah. Bye bye. <laughs> Listen, thanks for coming to another Tatsu stream. That was great. I'll see you guys next time. Have a wonderful rest of your day, night, evening, wherever you are. Bye bye. Anjane. Tabada.